I'm Fox Channel. How are you guys doing? We are playing another new update for Conrad Steve's Despair Normal PI. Every other week we get one of these. It's even every week, it seems like it. Uh, this update adds a new ghost on Jefferson Street House, which I am incredibly excited for because if you remember, Jefferson Street House is the house that has the demon and the residual ghost, which were two different families that were like interconnected, but like every family is getting hunted. Also, I've never seen, I'm getting distracted. I've never seen this ghost here. Has this always been here? Have I never looked at the title screen of this game? <laughs> Has that always been there? Anyway, um, that's, that's, I, I can't believe it. I need to go back in my old videos. Um, but as I was saying, this is the house with the demon that's been haunting every family for like a hundred years already, which is really cool. So they added a new ghost there and it's an intelligent ghost. So I wonder if we're going to get some information about the demon out of this ghost or how this ghost died. It's going to be interesting to see. Uh, and then after that, we are playing This is a Ghost, which has also gotten a new update. If you don't know This is a Ghost, it's a very fun, honestly, one of my most like the ghost hunting game that I currently enjoy the most to play. Uh, and they've added a new map. However, I don't think we're going to be playing the new map today because the way you unlock the new map is by having a high reputation with one of the guilds as well as having 20,000 in-game dollars and I don't have any of that so we're probably gonna try and grind for it today just have a lot of fun I love that game uh, also neglect this thank you for the five gift subs thank you and store star lord rat drax thank you for the 12 months uh, but we're just gonna go say hi YouTube have a great time with both of these ghosts on the games I'm excited it's gonna be a lot of fun today go say hi YouTube here we go all right Hi YouTube, how are you doing? And welcome back to Conrad Stevens' Paranormal PI. I know I keep saying this, but it felt like literally yesterday that I was here with another new update video. But once again, there's been a new update, and this time they've added a, uh, an experience system where instead of earning golden trophies, you will now earn experience, which this experience can be used to unlock new items, which will be added in, in the near future. And you can also buy the items with the experience, as far as I know. Now, I think you still earn the trophies, but they're not going to be the way you you buy the equipment they're just like a little bonus on top of things so you don't have to finish every mission that's what they try to avoid now on top of that they have also added an intelligent ghost to our favorite map in the game the demon house jefferson street house now if you don't know this house it is one of uh it's it's the house where we found the demon as well as the residual in a recent episode that i will link in the top right now what is really cool about this house is that these different ghosts are interacting with each other basically the story of this house House, is that there's been a demon that's been haunting the house for over a hundred years and uh, it's been haunting these different families leaving behind ghosts of killed family members and it is just a really cool very dark disturbing story that i cannot wait to explore more of with this new ghost so i hope you join us for that it's gonna be a lot of fun if you're not subscribed please do so if you like the video like it if you dislike it dislike it but let's not waste any more time and let's hop into the game let's go all righty Oh boy. First of all, we need to see if we got any new information on this shadow ghost. Uh, probably gonna be in the email, I'm guessing. I also know there's new notes to collect. Let me check the email. Uh, so Jefferson Street House has, uh, let's see, do we have anything? Within this first, oh wait, uh, this is a completely new email. My name is Dolores Slocum. <laughs> And I am the mother of three children, Cece, Bernie, and Evi. Cece, my oldest child, has been worrying me with her behavior, and is, it is why I am contacting you. To put things simply, I feel that I have been the best mother I can be, but Cece is beyond my reach. I don't want to disclose too much, but she has gotten herself into quite a mess recently. It's gotten to the point where social services have been out to my ho home and questioning my ability to parent my own children. It may seem ridiculous, but I s b believe she may be possessed by some sort of terrible spirit. She did not always behave the way she does now. In fact, I distinctly recall her changing rather abruptly about three months ago. We have lived in our house for about three years within the first six months of, six months of living here. From time to time, I would see shadows passing in my peripheral, uh, which might be the other ghosts, I'm not entirely sure. I work so much and I'm exhausted most of the time, so at the time I figured it was just me being so tired. However, six months after my initial sighting, I started hearing a woman's disembodied voice from behind the wall. At first, it seemed like maybe our neighbors had their TV up too loud, but now after the last visit from social services, Cece started l talking in tongues. As I started to reflect on everything going on, I started to believe that there is something paranormal going on. Over the last week, I have been trying to be more observant, knowing I was going to contact you. It seems like the shadows appear around the bedrooms 
of the house, I have heard the woman's voice in almost every room on the main floor, but not as regularly as I see the shadows. Additionally, in my opinion, I believe there are unusual changes in temperature throughout the house. From what I have read online about these occurrences, I am convinced that there is some kind of spirit living in our home. I'm so looking forward to your response. I just want things to be back to normal again. Dolores slow come. Okay, so that doesn't seem to refer to a shadow. I mean, there's some shadows here. Let's see. We have shadows in the bedroom, shadows in peripheral vision, disembodied voices, voices in most rooms. Now, is there also... An, let me check the wiki. Is there anything about the wiki? No, it's just... The church is still the only one that has a wiki page, which makes sense. They're not going to make a wiki page on someone's house. That would be a little weird. Uh, this is just... They completely got rid of this page? Or No, no, there it is. <laughs> uh, I have... Oh, experience point earned 14? Really? They turned my 14 trophies into 14 experience points? God damn it. I feel like I got scammed. But okay, then. Um, let's see. I feel like that, that this, those trophies were worth a lot more than that, but all right. Uh, let's go into the archives. Anything on Jefferson Street? Uh, what is this? Depression or possession? That's that's that. I want to see quickly because I have a message from the dev that talked about the ghosts. Um, the last ghost on Jefferson. So this is the last ghost to tie the story together, by the way. Uh, it is a, an intelligent ghost. Uh, we need to go to the back of the house. Okay. Um, I see. Okay. I don't think he, he didn't talk about any notes of the, of the ghost. So I'm not entirely sure about how we need to get, uh, like information on this, on this. I guess it's, if it's an intelligent ghost, shadows are always going to be good. Depression or possession. Kathy, Kathy, Kathy died suddenly. Uh, let's see. He sees outburst may be demonic. Uh, whose puzzle could this be? Uh, we have this. Cecilia's dabbling with black arts. I think we might do this. Cece's outburst may be demonic. Is there anything else? Because we want some information on the demon as well, right? We want just every ghost to be active. It's going to be a whole family reunion. It's going to be a lot of fun. <laughs> the possession equals demon. We know about that. I think that's about it. That's all we need. Because now we have every, every note that refers to uh, shadows as well as a like several or two notes on a demon just to fill out the list so i think we're gonna go in with that uh yeah i mean we could actually let me see uh possession equals de no i don't want to go here i could go take out the possession equals demon one uh there possession equals demon and then replace that with like uh one of the archive ones since they're probably more rare so cecilia is dabbling with black arts let's do that um and then we could add more to it but we don't we're not really that interested in the demon right now we just want to see the new ghost all right anyway that is all our notes we're gonna go in with that arthur thank you for the three months in advance jc clips thank you for the nine months and white side thank you for the seven months seven with the four months roop with the eight months ariel with the 12 months thank you guys holy shit sakura with the 16 genesee with the 13 months uh l dale with the prime biotic cow with the 15 months thank you all righty new sweater who this i know right uh oh Almost pulled up my thing. Okay, so uh, Jefferson Street is the house we're going to. As you can see, we have two ghosts, and we have ex we have investigated these quite thoroughly. I can show you some of the audio logs that we collected on them later, and we might see these, especially this one right here. We might see them uh, when we go to this map. Now, I'm uh, very curious to see what they got in store for us with this new new intelligent ghost. I feel terrible about Dolores' situation. Aye, aye, aye. Possession is such a controversial topic, and quality help is often difficult to find. I guess the best thing I can do to help is determine if anything paranormal is going on in their home. If it is, then I should obtain as much evidence as possible. I'm sure I'll be able to find enough evidence to support their claims Alrighty. and put their minds at ease. Okie dokie. So, uh, a new intelligent ghost now Again, as I said, the story of this house is quite disturbing uh, if you haven't already heard it. Now, before we do anything else, the notes that we have right here. So in this game, you have to take notes, which you can find these notes in the emails you get and in the like notes you find in the houses themselves. You can take si up to six of them and every note that you have on a specific ghost will make them more active. I just immediately hear someone say something. I'm not sure what, went, what happened. Um, Someone's walking around. So the notes we have are there. The the 
Where residents of this house saw shadows in their peripheral visions. They heard disembodied voices. They saw vo they heard voices in most of the rooms. They've seen shadows in the bedrooms. And then the child that's living here, Cece, has had uh, outbursts that may be demonic, and they are dab and she was dabbling with black art. So that is the information we have. Uh, and there's up to three ghosts that we can investigate during this. So we might see a bunch of people. Uh, now let's check back here because I know that the ghosts uh, or the demon is uh, residing in the basement. We've seen the demon many times. Now, what's really cool about the demon is that it's, I mean, it's not very cool if you're one of the people living here, but it's been here for a very long time uh, because every time you investigate a house, you get like a log of the people that have lived here, like since it was built. And for a very long time, there have been different families living here and you have... <laughs> What the fuck? I think I think we may have already have a visitor right here. <laughs> it's just been killing. Oh! What a rare experience to take a photo. Yep. Of All right, I'm leaving. Goodbye. <laughs> what the fuck, dude? Instantly. Uh, there's apparently a garage. Oh yeah, there's a garage right here. I didn't even know that. We should be looking in the garage a little more today, because I've been told by the dev there might be something interesting going on in the backyard in the garage. All right, well, there's obviously something going on down there. That is the demon that's been haunting families. Oh! What? Did you see that? I saw, what the hell? <laughs> what is going on? We're just here, man. Excuse me? I saw definitely saw a shadow. She like walked into the ceiling or something? Maybe the house has changed? Like the setup of the house has changed and there used to be a different used to be a staircase going up or something? I'm not entirely sure what the hell is going on. But it's action packed right now. What the fuck? Okay. So, <laughs> as I said, the demon has been haunting the place for a long time, and it's been Ooh. <laughs> What the fuck? <laughs> oh my god. Oh boy. Oh boy. We gotta run. We gotta run because the demon is coming. There it is. Oh god. Oh, okay. I made it out. <laughs> that's that's the demon right there. Hello. Uh, now, okay. I'm gonna go a little bit all over the place because there's just too much. There's just too much action right now. Holy shit. Um, the, I'll keep that as audio. Yeah, I'll de I don't know if I heard that before. I didn't know what it said just now. I was kind of talking over it. Um, but the uh, there's a system that they're building, which I kind of explained poorly in my previous videos. People keep commenting on my videos like, the dev already said that you're not going to be able to die in this game. And I don't remember saying that. I might have said it. If so, sorry. I, I knew the dev was never going to add a kill system to this game. But the dev is going to add some kind of system where you can be knocked unconscious or you can lose battery of your items if you get grabbed by the ghost. So there's going to be some rep some kind of repercussion for you being grabbed in the future, uh, which... I mean, if you lose all your battery and you can't investigate anymore and you have to leave, that's kind of like dying in this game then. Because, uh, like, if you can't investigate anymore, like, what happens if Asmo, if you die, you leave and you come back? What happens in this game if you get grabbed and you lose all your battery, you leave and you come back? So it's like, it's kind of like dying, but not really. Like, <laughs> it's the same effect, right? That's what I tried to say. I guess I explained it very poorly. Uh, Use your use your words. I think I've heard that in the in the in the That's past. We got cool. it. Nice. Uh, let's go. I want to see the shadow again. What the hell was happening there? Now I'm good. Oh, was that? Did I get it? Fuck! That has it said something. All right, let's talk. Is anyone here? Is there anyone here who would like to speak with me? That was from last time. Yeah, dude. There's so much shit happening. I love it. <laughs> That's why you take all the notes. Is there anyone here who would he like has to so speak much activity? I'm right, not here. Was it real quick? Uh, I'm gonna. St is there a light switch here? Maybe? No. Oh, there you go. All right. I don't know if this helps, but I'm just gonna stand here. Oh no! Don't turn that off. And we're gonna say, uh, "Are you? Do you have a Can name? You tell me your name." What's the name of this game? It is called Conrad Sievis's Paranormal PI. It's the longest name of any ghost hunting Can game you out tell there. Me your name? But it makes up for it in, in lore. Okay. Uh, how many people? No, maybe. How many people are here other than me? I there. Ha I didn't even know this place had a garage. Until 
The death told me. <laughs> How many people are here other than me? Okay, nothing happening right now. I really love how they built the, the atmosphere in this game. Like, the houses, there's cars parked on the street. That lights are on in neighboring houses. Uh, which you can even almost look in here. There's an invisible wall right here, which I can't go through. Uh, but, okay. So, in the backyard, we, we saw something in the back of the house. But not, not quite in the backyard. But it's it's extremely dark here. There might be something walking around. Who knows? Uh, okay, not yet. Hello there. I also want to find more audio logs on Dolores. Because the, the interface of the game is kind of bugged. It'll show you like six out of six collected, but you can still collect more. As you saw, we had like 13 out of eight collected, which doesn't really make any sense, obviously. All right, I'm going to stand right back here because this is where we saw the shadow. And I'm just going to see if there is anyone here. Do you like the current family living here? Hello? We're just going to get attacked by the demon out of nowhere. Do you like the current family living here? Kind of got a response, I'm telling you. Uh, so the people that have lived here... Oh my god, I didn't mean to open that. Uh, the people that have lived here in the past are... Uh, there was a family with a, a girl called Kathy or Kathy or something. Uh, and that girl was the first... One of the first people possessed. And we found some news articles on the person who got possessed. Uh, and that they ended up killing their entire family. Which is not, not, not a very nice thing. Uh, but now... What is really cool and really dark about it is that it's happening again. And there is now this late, this girl called Cece, which is the current inhabitant, the daughter of the current inhabitant, who is being possessed now and seems to be getting more and more aggressive, potentially leading up to the exact same thing happening again. So we, I'm hoping in the near future, we'll be able to like protect Dolores and Cece uh, from this fate and we might be able to figure out how to get rid of the demon like that would be so cool where you're actually like helping out families uh, of this, this kind of stuff that is like a really cool <laughs> something that I have like I've never in any ghost in the game you're just like exercising the ghost because it's like fun to do right it's 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 just the, the way the game works but actually exercising a ghost because there's like people you want to save now even if you can't really see the people gives a whole new aspect to the game oh! what the hell <laughs> where did you come from jesus christ excuse me you like the current like family, the family living, living here, here? <laughs> oh my god that was a quiet approach man you came out of nowhere <laughs> do you like the current family living here what the hell <laughs> Healthy demon. I, I, you don't want to... Just give me your name. Say it's Cecilia. Name. Say it's... Oh, my God. <laughs> Can you Island confirmed? Name? Maybe. Hmm. Ghost does not want to talk. What do we got right now? We own... We have two pieces of audio, and we obviously have a photo. Oof. Ooh, that is eerie that is indeed audience. very eerie. Okay, I'm. Is that new? That was a very unusual noise. That was indeed a very unusual noise. Okay, I've been collecting lots and lots of audio evidence. I think we got to go back to the basics. We haven't even <laughs> used the EMF and the and the thermo at all today. I get that too. I heard some demonic tongues. That might be sissy. Wow, that's great. Audio nice. Audio. Holy shit, we're getting... Dude, what the hell is going on? It is extremely cursed. That was a very unusual noise. <laughs> Conrad's I'll having a field day. Evidence. Holy shit. Okay, then. Uh, I, I can't even pull out the EMF, because as soon as I do, I'm getting... Oh, no, that's the, that's the microwave in the fridge giving us EMF, which is... I mean, I love that type of detail. All right, do we... Oh, you turn on the light! Wait, that might be the... That might be the the intelligent ghost. Could intelligent ghosts love to play with lights? Wait, what are you doing? What light are you turning on? Something out here? Hello? My oven gives off EMF3. Was that down here? I'm not entirely sure. All right, we need to just look for some cold spots. Also, get rid of these freaking... How do I get rid of these units? Spacebar. Okay. Now, now everyone can understand what's going on.
I hear insane rumbling and oh here we go it seems to always be in this room because this is cc's room <laughs> these temp readings are unusual oh. no 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 give me more oh. there she's just expressing herself which what's really wow, cool audio, is the ghost that's here like so there's two ghosts that we know of the demon in the basement and the mother of the child living here in the past who all got killed. And you can hear, based off the audio that it's giving us right now, that she was trying to, like, stand up for the daughter. Like, she's just having some gro growing pain. She's just... She's just... <laughs> she's just going through puberty. Unbeknownst to her, she was actually turning into a murderous demon, leading to the whole family's demise. Whoa. I'll keep that as audio evidence. Okay, that is new. Get out of here. So I really wonder if... The, wait. I swear I saw someone walk in there. Did someone just walk into the bushes? I really wonder if this new intelligent ghost is going to give us information about the demon. Because it seems to be all surrounding the demon. Now, I also know that this is the last ghost that's going to come to this house. So this ghost is going to complete the story of this, this, uh, this building. And the families that have lived here in the past. So we need to go full all out on this one. We have to figure out what, what happened here. Also, I would really like to get some EMF. Because any EMF that you get uh, will give you additional activity. Ooh. I'm guessing that's just... What? I'm guessing this is something that's just here. Looks like this is a normal EMF reading. Of what, Conrad? Of what? The The couch? What are you talking about? What the fuck? Conrad, you're you're too much of a skeptic. Oh, is the, is the generator back here, I see. Okay, maybe it may... I didn't get that, I don't think. What the hell was that? Did I get it? Please tell me I got it. No! All right, I'm going to stand right here. The ghost seems to be extremely talkative over here. Do you want to is speak? Is there anything you'd like to tell me? In the tree. Don't read this x-ray vision. Is there anything you'd like to tell me? He can feel EMF himself. Come on, you gotta talk. Why am I Do here? you know why I'm here? Pay attention, because there might be a shadow walking around here. Do you know why I'm here? Because we saw a shadow up there earlier. Right, you're a little, a little plain hard to get, huh? Alright, go back to EMF. We need more temperatures while we... We only got one temperature reading so far. Oh! It's just a wind. Not gonna be... Let's see. It's gonna be... Bullshit again. Here we go! It's always in Cece's room. Looks like just a cold spot. Nothing paranormal. Sh Conrad! Did you... It was six degrees! What are you talking about? <laughs> Conrad is a skeptic now. <laughs> I mean, it's always been a skeptic, but come on, man. What the hell? What do you mean, nothing paranormal? That happens in your house? Oh. That's gonna be the television, isn't it? These lights are acting oh, funny. Oh, never mind! I continue investigating. What the hell? Okay, the ghost was just standing here for a really long time, and now it disappeared. Or no, it went to me. BMF meter should not behave this way. This is paranormal. What? Excuse me. Excuse me, moi. Oh! Oh, wow. fuck! Ow. I'm not sure what's more impressive. <laughs> I took the photo, or I'm going to survive this. <laughs> I kicked the table so hard. Ow. <laughs> My knee. <laughs> fuck. <laughs> I did not expect that at all. <laughs> Jesus Christ, this demon is going to make me get a heart attack. Holy shit. Okay, well, uh, that was not the not supposed to go that way. Anyway, do we get any cold spots to finish off the book? <laughs> God damn it. Oh, fuck. Come on, give me another cold spot. And you better not attack me again, you son of a bitch. You came out of nowhere. Every... What? What? What was that? Excuse me. Excuse me. What are you doing? This demon is going crazy. It's going sicko mode. 
I just want the cold spots. I just want one more cold spot, then I have almost everything. Because we got... Yeah, there's... We got all the EMF. We got one temperature reading. So we need one more temperature reading. And then we need... Yeah, we already got that one. She's just expressing herself. wonder if we got everything about... Uh about Ka kathy or whatever the fuck something oh. is going on nice there. okay these temperature readings are definitely paranormal. let's go so we got all the temperature we got all the temperature we got all the emf we got more than three pieces of audio and we got a photo but we do not have any evps yet and nor do we have a photo of the shadow i huh I, I think I saw something. I saw like something around the corner and it was doing it making a noise, but I didn't get the photo. <laughs> I guess it didn't show itself. What the hell? Okay. Okay. So something's definitely going on here. Uh, any notes, by the way? We need to look around because the notes give you usually some of the most information. Like right now, we only have one audio log on the ghost and it said like go away or something. I wonder if this ghost fought back against the demon in some way. Let's just try to get something, some chats over here. How many people How many are people here? people are here other than me? How many people are here other than me? Talk to me. Come on, man! Live Is here. Is this your home? It used to be, probably. A few. Is this your home? Come on. I swear you gotta talk to me. You gotta give me some. Alright, let's check in the basement. Even though I hate it. Yep, never mind. <laughs> Ooh, that is eerie audio evidence. Right, I'm going to the backyard. <laughs> no, I've had enough of the basement for now. All right, do you know why? Why are you, why here? Are you here? <laughs> I fucking love this house, dude. It's so good. Why are you here? I really love how the ghosts are so connected here. Like, they all have a story that's interconnected, which... I wonder if we get more information about the other houses, if we can see something similar there. Which, if you want to see more of, um, the, like, the, the previous houses and their story, I recently did a video where I went back to the first house, or my last, uh, uh Conrad Stevens' video, where I went back to the, um, to the first house and found so much more new information that I've never seen before. So yeah, I highly recommend checking that out if you want to learn about other houses in this game. Right, I'm, I'm... Never mind. What the hell is going on down there? Every time I go down, there's some cursed shit going on, man. What the fuck? <laughs> this is freaking haunted. Talk to me. Can you tell me your name? Just kidding. Have a nice day. Exactly. Understandable. Have a nice day. Can you tell me your name? There has to be an answer. We've only seen the ghost in the back here, right? In this hallway at the back. Why here? What happened here? All right, are you going to be active again, you son of a bitch? I'm just here to check for notes. Oh, wait, no, that's just a light switch. I think how the notes work, they might be... Oh, that looked like a note. They might be... They might be slightly bugged in where you first have to do a, a full voice. investigation before notes show up in the second investigation. So I think with this investigation, have like, but it, we've collected a bunch of evidence, mostly on the previous ghosts we've already found. Uh, but we did see the shadow ghost a few times. And we also had one, at least one audio log from the shadow ghost. So let's do one more pass through here. And then I think we have to leave and come back to actually get any of the notes. I'm pretty sure that's how it currently works. And we're going to get, I think, a gold trophy. I wonder how much experience we're going to get. Because they have added a new experience system, as I said. Uh, and it seemed like they have turned every golden trophy I've collected so far into one experience point. However, I wonder... Uh, oh, here we go. Oh my god, you get so much experience. So you don't just have to 
A hundred percent in basically. Oh my god, audio recordings? Well, how much the photo? Also, gimme. So a perfect investigation is 50. See that? I, I dude, fuck you. I got 14 golden trophies, and instead of turning every golden trophy into 50 experience, they turned every golden trophy into one experience. So <laughs> I've been scammed out of a lot of out of like 700 experience points but whatever i guess i'm gonna have to earn it again so yeah we got 50 uh on that location it's fine it's fine <laughs> but there's no items you can buy with it yet anyway so if, if they're gonna add new items i'm gonna instantly be able to buy them and i want to be able to like play the game more than that but anyway so we pretty much uh, let's listen to the audio real quick because we got some new information right let's go to jefferson street uh kathy ronda's Ro wait we know ronda I think Rhonda was in the other story as well. Wait a minute, I remember this name. This is one of the other daughters, isn't it? What? Oh. Is that the is that the the daughter that was possessed? Get out. It's, it's someone's fault. It's blah blah fault. I don't know. I did it. He didn't. It's someone's fault. Someone's fault. It's all his fault. It's all your fault. Someone's fault. It's not my fault. Someone's fault. It's hard to hear. Get out of here. Okay, get out of here. I hear it's all his fault. I was just playing. Wait, wait, we got so much audio in this ghost. What the fuck? <laughs> I was just playing. Okay, wait, we got four different audio tracks on the Rhonda Shadow. Now I'm really curious. So let's go to the archive because I remember Rhonda. Rhonda Defoe. Oh, here, look at this. <laughs> Rhonda is the demon. Oh, so, oh my God. So, uh, the Kathy, which is the shadow ghost is the mother Rhonda the shadow intelligent shadow is actually the demon so i wonder if when they add the exorcism system or some kind of way to get rid of the ghost if we're gonna have to interact with Rhonda and make the Rhonda and the demon fight each other or something because here Rhonda the foe a 28 year old woman was charged with shooting and killing her family during a brisk spring evening in 1992 police responded to a call from a residence in old town a few miles west of the historical district around 11 30 p.m when they arrived Rhonda was found on the sidewalk in front of her home with a lever action rifle by her and blood on her pajamas on approach she ap appeared to be unconscious and emergency services were called Rhonda regained consciousness while receiving first aid she began lashing out in a roar of curses and screams she had to be sedated on site to ensure everyone's safety when officers arrived at the front door one officer reported that he could feel the house rumble which is what we have also heard um but quickly chalked it up to a nearby train line uh, oddly enough, the train had been down for maintenance that night. Also, the doors in the home would not budge, even though they were assumed to be unlocked. The officers eventually broke the front door down and searched the interior of the house. They were not prepared for what they found inside. All of Rhonda's family was murdered with a lever-action rifle, which was by Rhonda's side when the officers arrived. The victims uh, were all found lying motionless face down in their beds, barely disheveled. The, fa the Defoe family was considered courteous and caring for the most part. Mr. Defoe was a banker for New Eidolon and a very trustworthy handyman. And Mrs. Defoe was a homemaker. So I wonder if she says it's all his fault, does that mean it has something to do with the dad? Is it the dad's fault in some kind of way? Um, let's see. Uh, Tanner, the youngest child, was in high school... Their daughter, Rhonda, had an introverted personality, but still had a circle of friends. Allegedly, after set settling into their home, uh, Rhonda, on la oh, wait, Rhonda became ill. Not a true sickness, per se, but a mental break, as her father once put it to one of the neighbors. A couple of neighbors gossiped about Rhonda dabbling in witchcraft and satanic rituals with her friend, which was the catalyst for her illness, of, of her illness. Kathy, Rhonda's mother, begged to differ and denied any mental break and rationalized the illness as her daughter trying to figure things out. Nobody could ever def 
find what happened to Rana and why her state of mind changed for the worse. There was no known motive for this crime. She never came out of her shell, except around her friends, and did not show any sign of aggressive behavior or malcontent to anyone or anything. Just a plain... Just a nice plain girl. For, for, for weeks, there was much speculation surrounding the murders, and a solid answer never surfaced. Rhonda was charged on three counts of second-degree murder, but she never reached trial. She was found strangled in her cell in an apparent suicide, which we think that is because the demon popped targets. Because demons, like, in lore tend to feed off of, like, weak, or, like, not weak, but, like, fear and... Uh, like stress and and anxiety and stuff like that, and I guess that that was what happened here, and they just hopped to a different target, which is very fucked up. So yeah, uh, Kathy died suddenly. We know that. We have Cece's outburst. We also found this uh, last time, which is a Mad Libs of uh, Christine. Could she could thought she could feel a presence in the basement as she folded her afternoon laundry. She could have sworn she saw a shadow moving back and forth in the corner of the utility room. Um, the room always had a weird burnt smell and was always warm. She looked around in the darkness and could not see a thing. The mirror in the corner did unblank her a bit. Leaving the room, she faintly heard a growl, which seems like the Cece or some child discovering the demon in the basement. Okay, um... So we're going to add some more notes. We're going to add the notes back and then we're going to go back into the house to see if there's any new things that we can find in the map to unlock more of the story of Rhonda and how she got possessed and why and what happened. Okay, so let's go back. Let's go. Uh, what do we do? Whose puzzle may this be? It might be... Oh! No. I Because I, it seems like it... Re no. Because it seems like these audio logs are from... Previous investigations, right? There's no way we found four audio logs on the same... I don't believe it. So it might be that some of the archives that we found are also pointing towards the Shadow Ghost. Like, this one might be pointing towards Rhonda, because it's about Rhonda. It's about Rhonda killing people. And then this one, Cece's Outburst. This one, Cece's Dabbling in Black Arts. I'm going to take the puzzle. Um, the Theobald headed earlier. Yeah, it's almost like 70 years of possession um and then we're gonna do the mail we're gonna do the shadow and shadow oh that's voices where's the shadow shadow shadows in bedrooms all right i'm drinking some water one second what is my favorite energy drink coffee or water um, none of the shit that makes you, make your arteries explode. Anyway, do I have everything? I do have everything. All right, let's go back. <clears throat> Each water, exactly. Oh, there you go. We got four out of seven no or audio logs on the new Shadow Ghost. I did not realize we collected that much information, but as you can see here, sometimes there's a lot more information than the game's lets, lets on that there is. Like, in this case, we found almost double the amount of audio logs, so maybe there's going to be more here as well. I don't know, but we got 53 experience. Let's go back in. I want to learn more about this ghost. There are three. I feel terrible about Dolores. Yeah, 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 yeah. Alrighty. Look at all the all the unsuspecting neighbors not knowing their uh, neighbor's house is actually possessed by a crazy demon. Hello there. Oh, I took a photo. I did not mean to. I really want to get a like a EVP on the on the shadow ghost. I think that's going to be really important to learn more about Rhonda. So now I know that we're dealing with Rhonda, which Rhonda is a victim. Remember, she might have killed her whole family, but that wasn't actually her. That was the demon possessing her. So we're not going to. Uh, she's not necessarily an evil being. She might just be fighting like herself, kind of. I'm also going to check if there's any any notes already on the ground. I know there can be some in the in the backyard right here. Uh, hi there. Turn those units around. There's definitely gonna be an instant. Are you hearing this? What the fuck? <laughs> Excuse me, what the hell is that noise? Uh, that's definitely a little 
Uh, that's the rumbling the the officers might have heard. Oh boy. All right. Well, anyway, we need to collect some more evidence. I'm gonna go upstairs. I... Yeah. Oh fuck. <laughs> Goodbye. All you. right. We'll keep that as audio evidence. Yes, yeah, sure do. Okay. Is she, is she gonna come attack me again? Please don't do that. I need to collect. Can I collect freezing temps outside? Because we want to mostly focus on the shadow. Because the more evidence you collect on... Wait, is warmer outside than inside? Interesting. The more evidence you collect on a specific ghost, the more, like, notes unlock. Oh! There we go! Alright. Oh, come on. Yes. Oh, no, no. Hmm, these temporary... Nice. That's definitely the shadow ghost. Come on, come on, get it all. Something is Swap the EMF. These temperatures. All right, no EMF readings yet. Paranormal. We found two temperature readings. Uh, now I would love to find your EMF as well, and maybe your notes if you got any. Are you coming from here? Oh, that's the. Is it the generator making this weirdo noise? No, it's not. It's not the generator. While this is a high EMF yeah, level, yeah, 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 it seems yeah. to be normal. Although they may want to call an electrician to ensure everything is wired correctly. I love how the the machinery in this game actually moves. It's it's a small detail, but it really sells the world. Um, it sounds like it's coming from here, from this couch. Well, like it's coming from the basement, maybe, and it's like clipping through. No, oh, because the basement is over here. Different areas that give this. This noise. Hello? Oh. Oh, Jesus Christ. Every time, man. Gets me every damn time. Alright, ghosty pants. Do you got any EMF for me? Do shadows give you... You, just... you can't see the... No, you can't see the, the ghost book anymore. I thought there was something right there. Uh, I hope they're gonna allow you to see the ghost book again in the future, because you used to be able to open the book on all the different ghosts in the game itself, but now you have to read up on those outside of the game, and then you... I mean, they're not that important, but still, I wonder if I can find EMF on a shadow ghost? I forget if that's a thing. Uh, why are you here? Why are you here? Come on, please talk to me. We got, we got cold temps out here, right? Why are you here? Can you go through the hole in the fence? No. Cause there's a, uh, there's a tiny fence in front of the fence. <laughs> this is like such a weird patch up job, but wait, what? <laughs> that's so funny. They, they, the dev was like, I got to give some character to this house. So I'm just gonna, this broke. And then they just put a tiny fence here instead of rebuilding the, the big fence. Small details like that. Okay. Why am I why here? I'm here. Coming for you, Rhonda gonna help you i thought you shadow ghosts don't do evp they might not actually now that you say it do they they're intelligent right but they might not do evps i mean there's still lots of audio we need to collect i know the demon does evp doesn't don't they why are you here why are you here you son of a bitch wasn't he an intelligent yeah but shadows are, are intelligent here? You suck, ghost. At least the demon is a little less aggressive this time. I'm gonna take that and bye bye. Wait, so there's a mirror, right? Is there a mirror? A very oh yeah, voice. there is a mirror in the basement. That is evidence. Is this what the girl? That's what the the child talked about, right? She talked about a mirror in the basement. What was that? Was that the demon? I don't think that was a demon. Oh, I didn't get that. What do you mean I didn't get that? Come on. I need to see the shadow ghost. So where are we going to stand for us to not interfere with the ghost? She seemed to be walking in the back of the house. And when I came up the stairs, she was right at the top, weirdly enough. Like, what if I stand here? Will she show up up there? Hello? Call me young, thank you for the 14 months. That's just right. Oh! 
Wait, this light switch doesn't do anything. Is that what she flicked? Wait. There's a completely useless light switch here? What the hell? Can they do something in the kitchen? Nope, it does nothing. Is there's this light is broken? Oh my god, it's definitely not this light switch just doesn't do anything. It's broken. Okay, and these two flick the hallway light. Interesting. Don't know if that's intended. Probably not. Alright, ghost. I'm your friend. Give me some email. All I'm asking for. Where did we get EMF last time? We got it in the house, right? But that must have been of a different ghost. That's the thing again. God damn it. Don't know why the light switch doesn't work. It is so damn. That's a bright. Oh, there you go. Flicking of the light switch. Probably this one, but no EMF because that's not how this game works. Dude, I wish that stuff. Hi there. Very creepy. <laughs> Very creepy. Oh. This is just the fridge again. God damn it. Give me EMF. Oh. This is going to be Ka Kathy or Kathy or whatever the fuck her name is. Come on. No, where'd you go? Fuck. Oh, there we go. These lights are acting funny. I should continue investigating. What the fuck? I'll keep that as audio evidence. This is Christmas. <laughs> that was a long sentence. Oh. VMF meter. All right, not nice. This way. This is paranormal. You got EMF. I would love to get the photo of the ghost. I don't know if that was of the. Of the shadow, though. It might not have been. Uh, I did not flick that light switch. Did you do that? Man, that is a good... That is a creepy-ass room right there. <laughs> that is one creepy light coming from a creepy room. Anything in here? Well, then. Gonna leave the light on. Thank you. Just be luck, luck. You think you for the four months? Okay, come on, Shadow. Did you turn it off? Nope. Oh, you still. Oh god. Did I already take that photo? I did not take that photo. I don't think I want to take the photo. I need to take the photo of. I mean, I could, and then the ghost, the shadow is gonna become more active. You know what? We should probably do that. Take a photo of the demon. And make the shadow more active that way. Because the demon is going to show himself and like... Bless you, I That's guess. extraordinary audio evidence. Extraordinary. This demon always goes crazy, man. Demon just wants a hug. And the demon wants to fucking kill me. Oh boy. Come on, ghost. Show yourself, you fool. Then over here. Because now we can also see the shadow up there. Because we know it can walk into, like, the ceiling for no reason. We're just going to be in the backyard, right? Come on. Did I get it? Please. It's too late or something? That was a very unusual nice. noise. Nice! Okay. Let's go. We got it, baby. Very good. I want to know what happened. I want to find out. Oh, we're on this clues, man. I want it so bad. Can we save her in any way? Are they going to be hinting at a way to get rid of the demon? That'd be extremely cool. Any demon down here? Any demon chilling? Wah, 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 what? What the, what the, what the? More audio. I mean... That's extraordinary. Nice. I think this, this sounds like new audio. It might be of the, of the shadow. 
Are you walking back here? Walking out the door. Being all creepy like. Is her like Rhonda again? Yeah. Rhonda. Oh. Hello there. You're flicking the light switch. Why don't you show yourself? Why don't we have a little heart to heart? Forgot that shadows don't talk to me. I wish they would. Ghost. Ghost. But I wouldn't give for it for a quick little shadow shot. Right. Come on, man. Can't wait to get my ass kicked and this is a ghost again, by the way. That's gonna be fun. <laughs> Game is extremely difficult. What the hell? It's going nonstop stuff. By the way, today. Wow, that's great audio evidence. I got a phone call for the first time in many, many, many months, maybe even over a year. I don't get calls ever. Um, I woke up because they called me at like 10 a.m. and I'm a fucking degenerate, so I sleep until like 11 or 12 sometimes. Um, and the I was just playing that one again. And the phone call started like, hi, with Ooh, X, and I'm not going to dox them. Uh, <laughs> we we repaired your lawnmower. Do you want to pick it up? And I was I was like, I just woke up. So I couldn't even speak. Like, my voice was, like, broken. And I was like, excuse me, what did you say? He said, like, we got your lawnmower. When do you want to pick it up? And I was like, uh, I think you got the wrong number because I don't have any grass. <laughs> and they were like, oh, yeah, I, yeah, this I this I thought Oh yeah, this number. Oh wait, no, never mind then. Alright, goodbye. <laughs> I was like, what the fuck, man? I was laughing my ass off. It was a good way to start the day. I was like, what the fuck? I don't have any grass, man. <laughs> I love how that was the way I knew that it was wrong. I was like, uh something's wrong here. <laughs> Could have got a free lawnmower? What am I supposed to do with a lawnmower? I don't have any grass! <laughs> Uh, oh, it turned on the light. I don't have any damn grass. Sell it, dude. You guys are. Take it, take it, take it, take it, take it. You guys are criminals in the making. Photo of entity. You guys have watched too much Shameless. You guys are like, oh, free money. Yoink. The hell? Use your words. Now, okay, we're getting more. But we aren't still not. Who is that? I'm glad Again? I it with a recorder. There's so much audio happening. What the hell? How keep that as audio? Evidence? It's nonstop. How much do we got? We got everything again. Is this a hundred percent investigation once again, dude? We can unlock so much experience here. But where the hell are the notes? I've been told the notes are in the garage at the trash. They're right here, but I don't see anything. Or in the basement in the trash room, which I also don't see anything there. So I'm not entirely sure where the freaking Shadow doesn't want to show itself. Two peas. Um. Here. Like over here should be a note, but there's no note. I know we collected a note here earlier. Oh, hi there. Well then. That's kind of sick. At least it doesn't want to kill me. <laughs> Look at me straight in the eyes. That's extraordinary audio Ooh, evidence. That is eerie audio evidence. Yep, indeed. That is indeed extraordinary audio evidence. All right, I'm going to stand at the bottom of this stair. You better show up now. Rhonda. Or I'm going to call your mom. Your mom is here too. She gonna be showing up again? Oh, beautiful eyeballs. So the ghost could be, as I've been told, it's either in the back right here, so in this hallway, or in the backyard, or in the garage. So that's the areas I have to explore. I guess I could stand right here. Wait, one second.
Imagine. The ghost showed up immediately. I missed it. Oh my god. Fuck off. <laughs> oh, did I get that? Dinner is ready? Get over here? Come on, please. Ooh, that is Let's go! Okay. Nice. That's another audio for the shadow. We might actually have it all now. Because that's like... I feel like we've gotten several new ones that we didn't hear before. But now where the hell is the shadow? Because we need the photo for our true collection. I am pretty sure the way the notes work is that if you investigate enough... It spawns in on the next game. Like, it doesn't spawn in on the same game. As, at least as, from my experience, but I might be wrong about that. Um, but if we have enough evidence, we should bounce and come back and then hope we get it uh, when we come back. But I really think we should get the photo. Get that? I'll keep that as Did? Dude, I have gotten so much fucking... <laughs> Dude, imagine living in this house and you constantly get demon noises. Like, every 15 seconds, there's, like, someone screaming. It's not her fault! Or this kind of shit while you're trying to sleep, man? That's extraordinary audio evidence. Regular Tuesday. Why? I saw the eyes move from there to there. It spawned on top of itself. What the hell? Do fire. Fire, huh? No fire. What does a man have to do to get a ghost photo, huh? Just one itty bitty ghost photo. That's all I want. I really love the light, how the light hits the grass. Come on. I'm not asking for my- You turn on the light in the kitchen, I did not do that. Does that mean you're here too? Oh, kitchen light just turned off. Hello? Someone was walking. Maybe? I'm not entirely sure. That's creepy, man. There's shadows in the bedrooms, too. They did talk about shadows in the bedrooms. That is true. Maybe there's some something weird going on over here, huh? That was just all his fault? I didn't get it. Come on now. It's just footstep noises, but I don't see... <gasps> oh! Wow. I'm not sure what's more impressive. I took the photo, or I'm going to survive this. <laughs> you shit, man. I wish the focus kissed the cook, by the way. Kissed her. Kissed <laughs> Sorry, I had to do it. I had to do it to him. <laughs> Alright, come on. <laughs> yeah, this guy is real chill after what just happened, huh? I hear so many footsteps, but I see nothing. Hello? Is just footstep noises? Maybe I should record the audio. Demon coming through this room again. Where the fuck are you? You shadow bitch! You killed your whole family! There she is! Incredible. I captured a ghost on film. What? We got it! <laughs> Finally! Just had to flame the shit out of her. <laughs> and she would show up. There you go. Alrighty, so she can be in the garage too. She was walking away from me. I wonder what she does, because every, every intelligent ghost, so that's obviously a shadow ghost, which means they're intelligent. Every intelligent ghost will usually say, say something when you walk into them. They'll be like, go away, or they'll say something else. 
So I wonder what this ghost will say when you walk into them. Now I'm quickly curious if there's a oh hi there. If there's any node that spawned, and if there's not a node that spawned, which I don't think there is, I've checked both the areas. Now, I want to leave and then come back to see if it spawns in, because we've collected a bunch of audio. We've definitely collected both the temperature readings from this, this ghost. We've gotten the ghost photo, like, there, we got so much evidence from this ghost, there's no way that we shouldn't have the note yet. Um... Because it's, it's never been this hard for me to collect a note. So let's just uh, get the heck out of here. Goodbye, Rhonda. Uh, and I really... Because the notes are going to give us the story, right? We need to get those. Uh, and we're going to get another 50 experience from this properly. Probably. Easy experience. The mask of the give of the prime. <clears throat> so this is just for free. This just gives you a double the amount. And then 18 for just a quick ghost photo. And another 50 right there. Look, we got 114 now. I'm gonna have a, a weirdest amount of experience forever now. Okay, so we throw in the same things and we just go back. We just go back, check it out again. Um, there's still two here. There's still two notes missing. Still two notes that we have to get. Uh, this one, this one. Unless I need to pick up different notes, but I doubt it, right? Isn't the inbox. Like, position equals demon. That's not going to be on the shadow. Disembodied voices could be about the shadow, I guess. But the shadow is going to be... Oh, no, that's voices. Shadow is just going to be more about the shadow. Possession. Where's the other shadow? I think shadow... Shadows are about shadows, right? <laughs> it has to be, so I'm just going to take those. I'm going to keep taking the shadows. I, oh, wait, whoa. Before we go, we need to check. We get any new audio? Did we get any new audio? I wonder. Let's see. Jefferson. Uh, Rhonda. Four. Five. New one. Please save her. Save her? Wait, what? Please save her. Save her or save me? Please save them. Save them. Save them. Oh, is this Rhonda trying to break free from the demon? <gasps> Another one. It's too late now. It's too late now. Just, and this sounds this sounds deeper than this one. This sounds like a like a kinder voice than this. Like this sounds like she is turning into the demon. Oh, so there's still one audio log left to collect, and we uh we need the notes, which are going to be really important. Okay, so. It seems like Rhonda tried to fight back against the demon, but eventually lost. Anyway, do we have a new picture? New picture of the demon? Uh, is every oh, here! Is this the alleged spirit of Rhonda? So it can also show up in the bedroom, I'm guessing? I do not see it, Conrad. You should be more skeptic. Because <laughs> I barely see anything. All right. Anyway, uh, let's go back. I really want to see this. Uh, so we got six out of seven, and we got the picture of a very creepy ghost right there. <laughs> Dude, we're gonna 100% this house. We're gonna 100% it. I feel terrible. It did say it was at the... At the bed... Or in the bedroom as well. So I guess that makes sense. Oh, boy. Oh there. I'm back. How you doing? Good to see you. So this is how the game is intended to be played, by the way. It's intended for you to go back several times to... Uh, explore the map over and over again. That's like the way the de that's why they Im they implemented the note system because they want you to do that. Uh, they wanted you to do multiple investigations. Get back here. Is there gonna be a note or not? I don't know. I don't see a note right now. I don't know if it stacks up through the course of multiple runs. Like maybe. I need to collect like a total of 10 evidence on one ghost before their notes spawn. But it's really weird that they haven't shown up yet. Oh. Well, hello there. That's gonna... No, that's gonna be the demon. And I know, if there's one thing I know, is that you need to collect evidence on the ghost you want to find the notes for. That's what the dev told me. Like, every ghost or every evidence you collect will contribute to evidence of... Um... <clears throat> To the activity of all the ghosts. However, if you want to collect notes of a specific ghost, you have to focus on them alone uh, and not spread your 
Like, not, not look for evidence on other ghosts. So let's just purely go all in on Rhonda, because we need to know more of Rhonda's story. Stuff? By the garage door? I don't see it. I can't find the notes. I can ask the dev real quick. Uh, I can't... can't... seem to find the notes. Gonna see. Maybe they maybe they got some tips for me. <clears throat> oh, wait, is that that so looks like a note, man? I thought that was it. I was getting excited, but no, I guess not. Any cold temps out of here? Hello, hello. Next to the couch, in the house. And I've been lied to? Oh, I don't see it. That is demon noises. I don't want any demon noises. As I said, I was n I want nothing to do with it. I want nothing to do with you. You're just expressing yourself. I don't care. Check the garage again. Other side of the garage. Over here? <gasps> yeah! You're right. Okay, so that is definitive proof that the notes show up after you've done a lot of evidence collection on the ghost. Because we haven't even gotten a single piece of evidence during this run. So the last run we did a full investigation. This run they spawn in. So that's where you have to come back. So if you do a full investigation, leave, come back, then you get the notes. Okay, here we go. The frog spirit. It is said that the frog is connected to our world and the spirit realm by all phases of living and death. It is with this knowledge that we as sisters must come together on this night and commune beyond the veil to renew our energies. Please join me and your sisters this weekend as we explore the magic of the frog spirit. We will also be attempting our first spirit summoning. Uh-oh. <laughs> Where? Jefferson Street? My house, you silly goober. <laughs> what to bring? Salt, lavender, candle, chalk, and matches. <laughs> you guys... So, Rhonda... This is Rhonda, obviously, I'm guessing. Jefferson Street, which is this house. So, they were, I guess, dabbling in dark arts as well. Uh... And they tried to summon a spirit, and I think they succeeded in that. They succeeded in summoning the spirit. Wait, okay. So, with that, we have to... Unless there's... Let's check quickly the basement. Is there another note in the basement? And then we should probably leave and add this note to be able to collect more evidence on Rhonda. Uh, unless there's another note here. But I don't think they... Sp I don't think two notes spawn. I think it's only one note at the time. Yeah, so let's quickly get out. Uh, we literally have nothing, so this is... <laughs> whatever. Uh, we're gonna get out, fill in the note, and and then come back. Also, creepy ghosts. Creepy ghost noises. Get me the fuck out of here. Goodbye. Go see it. I really need to get some sleep. <laughs> <laughs> I'm gonna get nothing. You're gonna be like, you suck. Me too, Conrad. Me too. I played, or, or, I heard of the game Hellseed. Maybe, I don't remember. And anyway. Okay, throw in the evidence. Um, this one. Prior owners use dark arts. We're gonna do Cecilia's dabbling in dark art. We're gonna do Kathy died suddenly. The puzzle, the CC's outbursts. And then we're gonna add like, now we can't add all the shadows, but I don't think the shadows are related to her anyway. Although I guess I could lay it. Take out one of the notes. I could take out the one on, um, on the outburst, right? I take out that one and then add the two shadows. Um, where is it? Shadows and <clears throat> shadows. All right, perfect. Uh, that's the list. That's the list. My final offer. Are there frog spirits in demonology? Interesting. Interesting question. Demonology. White horse. What the hell is this, by the way? Wait. I didn't even ever see this. What is this? Demonology. Amongst many religions and beliefs, there's a story of the end times. These shared stories attribute the catastrophes 
of the world to be brought on by the people of the world. However, the major drive of this world's world destruction is far greater than mere humanity. The evil that lurks and manipulate these events are said to be a hierarchy of demons. At the very top of this echelon are powerful deities summoned from godly seals to rule part of the world. They are the four horsemen. The demons that invade our world are of a lesser power since the aforementioned greater demons have no time for small pursuits. The horsemen sent their cohorts, cohorts to disturb the ethereal plane and try to gain a foothold into our physical plane of existence. Most demon are de demons are deeply rooted in their own plane and portray attributes that display their power of origin. It is spe speculated that these demons may have weaknesses comparable to their opposing attributes. Additionally, investigators have not been able to specifically identify how these demons are able to invade our plane. This is new? I don't, ever, I don't remember ever reading this. White Horse Conquest. He is envisioned as a noble adorned with a crown of the purest gold and brandishing a silver bow. He traveled, tr he traverses outstretched lands seeking the rulers of the world to corrupt and overthrow their kingdoms into collapse. Lesser demons wind. An old, so fire? That seems to be related to our. An old soldier with their taste for blood and chaos. The strength of this being is inflamed by the quarrels and great wars he begins while never failing to any other, while never falling to any other warrior. His mighty greatsword was ever covered in the blood of many battles. Heal horse, famine. Uh, a peddler of medicine, he does not heal anyone. His skills of gluttony balances those who wish to indulge in abundance and shun the need of others. Hope is drained from the world when he drains their sins, dry to bolster his own power. The lesser, lesser demons are earth. Black horse, death. Death incarnate. She ventures abroad, seeking the old and dying while increasing despair. Her presence siphons the will of the greatest men. Her scythe is the final judgment which cuts a swath in her path. Quelling the, quelling, quelling, quelling the judgment of her brethren. Lesser demons are the shadows? This is where the shadows are from? Well, what the hell? I wonder if that's going to be like important later. Oh, and here we go. This is the spirit. So these are the different ghosts, which we can check. Shadow ghosts are the second category consists of spirits known as shadow people. Most paranormal investigators believe that these entities left their lives unfulfilled. In a rare number of cases, resolutions for the spirit was identified and achieved causing the spirit to disappear. Once this case was resolved by putting a spirit's old shoes back in the wall where they were found during remodeling. Shadow people seem to interact with the EMF and temperature sensor in a playful manner. Disembodied voices are often heard recorded during investigations, but EVPs have never been captured. So no EVPs. Shadow people seem to be the most photogenic ghost type. Investigators usually have at least one solid ghost shadow person within their portfolio. Okay. And then obviously the demon as well. Um, okay. So... Cool. I did not know. I didn't see that page earlier. Let's head back in. And now with our newfound information, can we get any more to happen? Let's go. Uh, we still have one audio to collect. Rhonda, thank you for the 300 biddies. Thank you, guys. Modern Christ, thank you for the seven months. Flitter Music, thank you for the five months. Dre Dreaming Junkie, thank you for the seven, seven months. Annie, thank you for the 10 months. Beatriz, thank you for the 21 months. And Una Patit Patatita, thank you for the prime. Hydroplasm with the eight months, Megs with the four months, Reina's with the six months, the Maskin with the prime again, thank you. And Neon with the prime as well. Alrighty. So, with our new note, which the new note, can I open it? Uh, prior owners used dark arts. It's the new note on, um, on Rhonda. So let's see. Now she should... So Rhonda was actually not as innocent after all. <laughs> she seems to be the leader of some kind of occult club that literally tried to summon a demon. And I guess they got what they wanted, but probably not what they hoped would happen, huh? Uh, oh! It's a new note. Just a burger... burger wrap. What the hell, man? Alright, um... That's not evidence. We need to collect evidence first. And then, so... Immediately? Let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go. One. He's gonna disappear soon. Get it both? Continue investigating. Don't leave yet, don't leave yet! I'm almost done! No! 
<laughs> you piece of shit. Okay, we have to stay on this path then. This seems to be the path of the ghost. Oh, oh! How rare to take a photo of a ghost. Oh, she runs away. Whoa, what the hell? Did you guys? <laughs> she runs away and climbs up the wall. Wait, what? She's scared. Oh, what the hell? Wait, that was a... I've never seen that type of behavior from a ghost when you got close to them. I've I've only seen the where they like scream at you and get angry at you. So she is scared. Why is she scared? Wait, that's interesting. I need now we need to collect the other note. What the hell? I scared her. There's something wrong with you guys. <laughs> you guys. You got problems, you know this? You have a severe case of booba. <laughs> you serve oh oh that's that. That's the thing. We can fix her. God damn it. Okay. Uh, maybe some freezing temps. Well, that seems to be effective. Get, using that note on this ghost seemed to have made her extremely active. I also want to collect some audio. Oh. That's very interesting. Why'd she back up like that? Did she say anything when, when it happened? I don't know. Give me another one. Need to collect. Because I only got... Well, I got the photo. I mean, that's pretty impressive, honestly. I could leave and just get the experience for this. Let's check in the basement. Is there a new note down here now? Because I've been told there's something to... F oh, there you go! Aha! This item is a valuable piece of information. It is Rhonda with the eyes scratched out of her parents. And Rhonda doesn't really look too great now, does she? <laughs> we found the... That's that's it. That's the last note on Rhonda. Which means that uh, with that amount of information, if we... I think I'm going to put that back in now. Because we already took the ghost photo, right? So we're going to get like a decent amount of experience already. We're going to leave... Fill in all the notes, so we now have two notes on Rhonda, which that one, I'm assuming, is a photo of Rhonda as a child. And then we can come back and get the final audio log, and then piece the story together completely. Uh, let's get it. Baby. Rhonda did have some... Uh, is it, is it bad that, like, when I think of the name Rhonda, I kind of think of a person like that? <laughs> Is that a thing? Am I fucked up? Or is that a thing? Like, certain names give me, like, certain type of image in my head. Like, Rhonda, like, Gertrude. I think of, like, an angry aunt. Like, Rhonda, I think of a, a girl like that. Uh, like, I wouldn't, like, if I hear the name Cece, I don't think of, like... <laughs> I don't think of like Gertrude and CC. I could take, I could tell a Gertrude and a CC apart 99 out of 100 times. I'm telling you. There's something to certain names. Lana, thank you for the 10 gift subs. Thank you. Uh, okay. I need the final note. So, boom, boom. Somebody had anger issues. Oh, <laughs> Conrad makes up his mind about this in a different way than I would have. Okay. So he assumed that this is Rhonda scratching out the eyes of her family members. Okay, I see. Well then, learn the rest and, and see. If we can find her for real. Uh, we do black arts. I like that one. I do the puzzle. And then I guess the shadow still. Shadows. Bitch, we'll do... Shadows in the bedrooms? Because she shows up in the bedrooms, right? So we'll do that one. I think so. And then, yeah, I think this list is fine. I mean, this is going to make her extremely active. We can fix her. I don't think I, uh, I don't think Rhonda is as innocent as we made her out to be. Oh, come on. I, I can't wait for the relics. The relics are going to be used for, like, exorcisms for sure, I'm guessing. I feel terrible about Dolores' situation. Yeah, yeah, blah, 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 blah. Oh. I'm gonna go... I'm gonna straight go back here. I wanna see you, Rhonda. Show yourself. You evil spirit. 
So yeah, we got everything now. Uh, the two notes are prior owners use dark arts and somebody had anger issues. And I've been told there's only two notes to find. So this is going to be all we get. And now we have to collect the last, um, the last voice lock, which I don't know why she's scared. That is not what I expected. I expected her to be angry. I guess maybe after the demon was summoned, she realized what she'd done. And she became scared of... Like, she had an internal fight. I think based on the audio log we have right now, you can say that there was some kind of, like, conflict within Rhonda going on. Like, she was trying to fend off the demon. Didn't really succeed. Because... I mean, obviously, she kind of did it to herself, but then she did it to the whole... Like, she killed the whole family. I mean, she did also die herself, but that doesn't mean that the innocent family had to take the brunt of the hit. Uh... All right, come on. Need to, we need to wait until the first evidence show up, shows up. I can't really do much. I can't force it. Robin, thank you for the 500 biddies. I'm gonna come from back here again. I think to turn on the light in here. We can see her easily without walking into her because I don't want to despawn her. Please save me. Ooh, that is eerie audio. So that is her being like, oh man, I fucked up. I need to be saved. But who did she say that to? Did she say that to some kind of priest or whatever? I'm not sure. Come on. Come on. Hello, Rhonda. This as well. It's like it, I, it did like several times. I've now had it walk from there to there, like in this arc. I'm just gonna keep patrolling this until I get the evidence I need. Oh, so well, thank you for the thousand bitties. Thank you. All right, come on, ghost. I guess we don't necessarily have to collect only her evidence anymore because we don't need the notes anymore. But finally, I've kind of learned how the note system works, like, for real. So I can use that in the in the future. Because it basically, you have to collect evidence on one ghost, and then go leave and come back, and then the notes will spawn. You can't get them. They won't, like, actually spawn in. They'll just be there next time. That's extremely important. Uh... Come on. You shy bitch. Why are you so shy? Maybe it's over here now. Still don't know how the... Oh, oh that's the fridge. Still don't know how the ghosts work in this game necessarily. Guess you could get a cold spot back here. Oh, there we go. All right, I think I'm just going to collect some evidence from the... Oh, yes. oh come on. Looks like just Fuck a cold you. spot. Nothing Fuck you. Oh, wait, what? It's all the way over here. Hmm, these temp readings aren't nice. Usual. Yeah, that might be her. Okay. Now we... Yes? This might be Rhonda, actually, because it's at the back of the house. Something is going on. Oh! <gasps> these temperature readings are definitely paranormal. <laughs> Black cats are for humans. Thank you for the five gifts. So, so my god. Oh! What? Wait, it's, it's here. It's Rhonda walking around. Come on. Oh, you disappeared? Really? Okay, well, anyway. That was a <laughs> creepy sequence of events. Uh, but I think this is Rhonda. I don't think this is the demon, because the back of the house is for her. I like that they kind of separated the ghosts. Like, it seems like the Ka Kathy ghost is at the front here. The uh, Rhonda ghost is here in the backyard. And then the demon is mostly in the basement. I think that's clever. Because then you can, like, know if you're investigating the right ghost. Especially when you need the notes. All right, then. Um, but now we understand why she seemed to be walking up the ceiling. That's because she was, like, fleeing from me. She was climbing up a wall. Here we go. 
Or walking. Oh no. It gives me shivers, man. Every time. Just need one more. Oh! Oh! There you are! Oh, what the fuck? Oh, I, to take a photo I did. I took it. I saw her, but only in the shadows. I didn't saw her on the photo cam. Okay. Maybe that's the audio we need. Maybe the audio we need is us walking into her. Maybe that's the last audio. Like, scaring her. She seemed to, like, get, do a gasp. Like, do a cry. When we got close. Well, then. It was over here. Any, any EMF? We need... Yeah, we need two pieces of EMF data that we don't even have. We haven't even started on it yet. Um, we got the temperature, though. And we need more audio as well. And she's gonna be max active. Come on. What is this name? This is called Conrad Stevens' Paranormal PI. One in the backyard. I think next time I see her, I'm gonna try and walk into her and then record the cry and see if that's an audio evidence. But it's extremely short, so I'm gonna have to time it well. Come on. Am I laughing? Yes, yes. Oh. Come on, man! You son of a bitch. I need that. The last, or the... The EMF. The last evidence I need. Bridge again. The televisions. You're in the way. Ali Cat, thank you for the 21 months. And Timmy Cammy, thank you for the 12, two, two months. I guess I could get it from the demon. The demon is probably going to give me some EMF, right? Got some e <laughs> Christmas. Got some EMF for me, or are you just going to yell at me? I right, never meant then. Oh, you out there? I I guess they did the summoning ritual in the backyard. Is what I'm guessing. Why else would the ghost be in the backyard? Come on, just camera shot. It seems like it. Maybe she, that's why she runs away. She's like, no. Take this side, my good side. Right, come on, you son of a bitch, you stupid ghost. Was that her again? Oh, that was the ghost despawning again. Man, she spawns in the, did I get it? I did not get it. She spawns in the most hard to see locations, especially if she walks around this corner. Like you can't see it before you're already walking into her. Um, That's unfortunate. Come on, we need that. That might be the last audio log. Which in that case, how, if the crying is the last audio log, what is Rhonda's story? Because it seems like Rhonda did not like get forced to do the dark ritual. Like it seemed, unless it was, no, oh, cause she had like a whole club and everything. Like she had a, she had a, <laughs> like a cultist friend group of people coming together to do these summoning rituals. There's no way that that would be something uh, that they like did got set up in like a few weeks after the demon got hold of Rhonda. That must have been the reason the demon got hold of Rhonda in the first place because they summoned the demon. And then since the demon has been haunting the uh, the house for like two decades now, um, and now poor Cece is being a target of it, which I think maybe Cece had the exact same thing happen to her because Cece also, here, Cecilia's is. Cecilia is dabbling with black arts, which I wonder if that was before or after her possession. Because maybe that would be so much of a coincidence, right? Two girls? Is it common for people to be interested in fucking black arts? <laughs> I don't. Is that a thing? Like, I feel like that must have been the cause of the demon, but that might just be that might just be my interpretation of it. Uh, so then Rhonda was like a little messed up. Uh, into uh, dark arts. They, um, 
Because that's what it said. Like, yeah, prior owners used dark arts. Um, and she tried to summon a demon. It worked. The demon took a hold of her, possessed her. And then she became scared. She was like, I don't want this. Like, save me. Um, it was it was all his fault. fault. So it might have something to do with the dad. Um, maybe. Uh, unless his is just like an ex-boyfriend. I don't know. Um, but I need to walk into her and then get the audio. Um, and then so the the story of the two, of Kathy, like obviously she got killed, uh, by the family member because. What we saw in the journal, right? A shadow is a ghost of someone who was unfulfilled in their life. I'm guessing she didn't want to go yet. Like, she was... She was... Because she was trying to fight the demon. But she became kind of, like... Like... Scarish. Like, she became scared of everything. That's why when we walk into her, she runs away from me. And she doesn't, like, try to attack me. Uh, because she's scared. So I guess she just got in over her head. She summoned this demon. And bit off more than she could chew and she got the whole family killed and then she is now potentially gonna get a whole different family killed and we hopefully can prevent that in a near update like we can try and do something about that uh i'm guessing that's the whole story i don't know where the frick ronda is i mean we've seen her uh but i didn't get the i mean i did get to take a photo but i didn't get to record the audio of her I cry when she runs away. I don't know if that's going to be the last audio log. Unless the last audio log is like a profound like plot twist. Or she's like evil maniacally laughing or something. And then she says like, it was all according to plan. I wanted to kill my whole family from the beginning. Maybe. I don't know. Uh, I doubt it though. I doubt the, the last evidence is going to give a whole new... Did I get it? I'll keep that as audio. Evidence. Yes! Okay, okay. I think that has got to be the last audio log. So there she was. Uh, now I'm going to leave to see if we 100% completed it. I'm guessing that has to be the last audio log. Because we didn't co collect that earlier. But it's just going to be her screaming. Although I also feel sometimes like there's audio logs that don't show up on the, like, the, the, the audio system. And they're just like bonus audio for some reason but conrad seems to uh seems to know that that was an actual audio evidence but yeah there you go another not a golden trophy but another 34 experience now do we get something from that let's see did we get another piece of audio uh jefferson and then oh whoopsie daisy and then no wait what oh let's go we did it! A hundred percent of all the audio. So now, once again, the story of Rhonda seems to be she was into, like, dark arts with a bunch of friends. They summoned the demon. Uh, the demon took a hold of Rhonda. Rhonda regretted it, became scared of herself and the demon inside of her. Uh, but she eventually lost the battle, killed the whole family. Uh, the f so when the family died, Kathy started haunting the place. Kathy is the mother. Uh, and then now the demon is back because we can we can check the timeline right we can check the timeline uh, of uh, in the archives right here so defoe owned the house until starting from 86 until 93 when they all got killed right because this was oh in 92 so it took like a long time it took like almost a year for the house to be sold which makes sense when a whole family gets murdered in a house <laughs> that's also what i love here look at this so the house got sold for a lot low it got sold for lower than it was purchased because obviously you're not going to buy a house that's just had a whole family murdered inside of it so it it got it dropped the the real estate price quite a bit um but then uh there were two families that lived in it completely peacefully it seems until 2018 when now uh the ghost is once again attacking so then it might have to do with the the daughter. Because look at this. Cecilia Slocum is doing... Cecilia was attempting what she called witchcraft to revive the frog. Another frog. We were dissecting today. She shouted profanities at me and her classmate while throwing the tr tray with the materials to the floor. She also threatened her lab partner. So may when was this? This was October 9th, 2020. Oh. 
October 7th, 2020. Uh, so they, that's been two years, because we can also read it in the email to piece together the time. I just wonder if the dark arts meddling was before or after she got possessed. That is, like, the main thing, because otherwise it seems to only target people that are already, like, meddling with stuff they probably shouldn't be trying to meddle with. Uh, let's see. So, three months ago... When does this email get sent? There's no... Oh, June... June 24th? I'm so bad at months. Uh, June 24th. Which was before she started meddling with the dark arts. Yes. Okay. So, she got possessed before she meddled with dark arts, right? Because... Oh, no, no, no. About... Yeah, because about three months ago... Uh, within the first six months here, you would see shadows, uh, but her behavior changed three months ago, which means unless this is 2021, which it might be, didn't, when did Conrad come out? Did Conrad come out in 2021? Yes, right? Wait, did it? Has it only been a year for Conrad? Wait, no. I forget. When did Conrad come out? Conrad came out in. We need to, like, fully dissect the lore here. I just, this is, like, very important for, for the... For the story, if it came out, if she got possessed, Conrad Stevenson's Paranormal PI came out in uh, 2022. So it might be that the story is based in 2022. Like the the, it might be that it's based in 2022, uh, which means that she might have gotten this detention notice uh, before. She got possessed, which is what I am going to assume because it also aligns with this story. So I'm thinking that she was already kind of like uh, interested in this type of stuff, similar to how Rhonda was interested in this stuff. And it seems to connect the people that are that are doing with that are like in, interested in this type of stuff. Uh, I'm un otherwise it's just that she was like also an easy target but anyway that's basically the story and we're tr hopefully going to be able to prevent cecilia from killing her whole family in the near future <laughs> or like when they add like some kind of exorcism ghost or exorcism system very cool absolutely love the lore this is like a completed the first ever uh fully completed uh uh, house and i want to do this same treatment for all of the other houses as well a few now, more notes would help ensure a better investigation yes i know i know uh so ronda i just got an achievement called ronda shadow by the way i 100 percented it um because i didn't have any notes that's why he says look at that we got a hundred percent on every single ghost in this one now uh polk street is still still got lots to investigate i wonder if there even another ghost here i'm not entirely sure uh, then there is also Evergreen Lane, which we already did a huge investigation on. I highly recommend uh, checking out that video if you haven't already, because uh, we figured out a whole lot more about these ghosts. And then the church seems to be like a more open map where there's like a lot of different stories, like this lady in white and the child, uh, the uh, Pierre, uh, the Siegerstein family, the demon in the woods, which was also summoned by a cult, by the way. And then also the ground or the re the reverend. And then we still haven't investigated the shadows here. So I wonder if there's new stories for that. Because there is a lot of lore to these places. And then look at the amount of stuff the dev has planned. Like, I really love how this whole story seems to be planned from the beginning. Like, it's not just something that the dev is, like, cooking up as he goes. Like, it seems like he actually has a plan with the way the game is going. So, yeah, very, very cool. And I wait to see more. I hope you enjoyed. Let me know what you thought of the story in the, the script or in the comments down below. Hope you enjoyed the video. If you're not subscribed, please do so. If you like the video, like it. If you dislike it, dislike it. And if you want to join the lovely gamers here in the chat, you can join us over at twitch.tv uh, slash insim or click the link in the description down below. And if you want to watch more of me on the YouTube right now, you can click this video in the middle of the screen. It is handpicked for you by the YouTube algorithm. Thank you so much. I'll see you around. Bye, guys. Have a good one. Bye-bye. Paranormal PI. 100%ed a map for the first time ever. That has never happened before. Now... We're going to hop into the next ghost hunting game that has got a new update. This is a ghost. They've done a new update for This is a Ghost, which we won't be able to probably play on the new map that they have added. Because as I said earlier, uh, the new map costs you $20,000 in the game. Uh, and I don't have any money. I don't think so. I think I'm completely bankrupt. <laughs> so it's going to take a little bit before we get that. But at least we're going to try. Uh... New update for this is a ghost.
This is a ghost. Here we go, baby. I am ready. Ready to rumble. Let's do it. You can also take more photos. What other stuff did they add in the patch notes? I should look at the patch notes. Because I didn't really look. Let's see. Uh, patch notes. Added a new map. Added interactable objects on several maps. The book will be able to collect more clues about the entity. And you can take three more pictures. So yeah, you can take more pictures. Uh, also, let's see, right? Um, let's see. And you... Uh, where can you buy it? Where is it? Unlock the new map. Holy fuck. <laughs> I need, well, I got 7,000 though. I'm not poor. I thought I had a lot less money. But I, I'm gonna need friendly reputation with them. That's gonna take so long. Did they hate me? I'm ignorant with them. Okay. So <laughs> that's a lot of reputation that I'm gonna need. So we need to grind up the night keepers in order to unlock the new map. All right. Well, anyway, let's go say hi, YouTube, and have a great time. Uh, let's scroll or get you guys over in the bottom and let's go say hi. Here we go, baby. Hi, YouTube time. Because you guys are supposed to be in the top, right? In the top, I think. That's where you usually go. All right, here we go. Hi, YouTube. How are you doing? And welcome back to This is a Ghost. They have done a brand new update for this game. I absolutely love this game. It's one of my most favorite ghost hunting games at the moment because it has so much left for me to do. I am super bad at this game, or at least I was pretty bad. I've been learning a lot, and I can now actually kind of defend myself and win some games on hard mode. But oh boy, does it take a lot of effort. It's just super fun. There's a lot of action going on. Uh, you can fight the ghost because you get actually guns in this game game however do not think that makes you uh, very safe because the ghosts are ferocious in this game they do not they do not give you an easy time you have to fight for your damn life out there it's really fun and in this new update they have added a new map however i can already tell you in this video i'm not going to be playing on the new map because they have integrated the map with the progression system in this game which i absolutely love the way the progression works in this game it's gonna cost us twenty thousand dollars to unlock the new map as well as a friend Friendly reputation with the night keepers now if you've watched last episode you know that i've been dying a lot and when you die the guilt that you're fighting for hates it you lose a lot of experience with them so i'm gonna have to try my absolute best this video to try and do as many investigations as possible die as little as possible which uh, we'll see how that goes i hope you join us for that it's gonna be a lot of fun if you're not subscribed please do so if you like the video like it if you dislike it dislike it but let's not waste any more time and let's hop into the game let's go Alrighty, uh, oof, I can click this out. So we're going to be going, starting off, we're going to go to the little house and we're going to try to go in on hard. Now hard is very difficult and we need to build a reputation with the night keepers, remember? So we're going to, maybe I'll start one mission on medium and then we go on hard just because if you start on hard, sometimes you get completely overwhelmed. And once again, survival is our main priority right now because if we die we're gonna lose a lot of reputation so we need to avoid dying at all costs to try and make as much reputation for the night keeper so we can unlock the new map which i don't know if it's gonna be a big map or a small map there's probably people out there that have already unlocked it because i'm not the pro in this game compared to phasmo i know like almost everything there is to know about phasmo this game not so much it's a little different here because i've only recently started playing i mean the game only came out recently but uh because because I, oh, how do you open doors again? Right click, that's a good start right there. Uh, because I only play it on stream, I don't have as high of a level as some people. Oh, wait a minute, they changed this. Hello there. Uh, does it have like a tally on how many times it get hit? That looks different. I also know they added more photos you can take now. That looks very, oh, this is second motion sensor, I see. Um, <laughs> What was that? Excuse me? I've never seen that in my life. I've played this game for how long? 14 hours? What the hell was that? I need to move my cam, sorry. Uh, because I'm on top of the health bar, which I got hit there. I lost some health. What the hell just happened? Is that a vengeful ghost? It must be vengeful. I'm gonna say that's a vengeful ghost. Oh, I have the wrong thing. Uh, so in this game, you have a lot of stuff you need to do. First of all, you need to collect evidence, which the evidence will give you the ghost type, and the ghost type will tell you what ammo you need to use to expel it, to, like, uh, exercise it. If you don't use the right type of ammo, it's gonna be extremely difficult to exercise the ghost. Uh, now I did- oh god. 
sensor two. Oh, it tells you which sensors get triggered. Interesting. Okay, actually really helpful. Uh, but all right then. I am a little scared now. Was that a banshee scream? That kind of sounded like a banshee scream. I'm gonna leave. Which don't uh sprint in this game if you sprint in this game you're going to increase the activity and the activity is kind of like your sanity the higher the activity the more likely it is for the ghost to hunt uh based on the type so for example here 60 to 100 percent or wraith it's 85 to 100 percent so the different ghosts have different levels at which they start their hunt and the hunt will basically not stop until you're dead or you've done enough damage to to, to the ghost to uh like make the activity go lower or to like kill it basically uh now let's read the banshee real quick the Banshee is an unshy entity that announces death before seizing the soul of its victim. It's cunning during its hunt phase, a real danger, even for experienced hunters. Its unique shout announces death, but makes it easy to identify. I'm going to say it's a Banshee. So we're going to go with, uh, what is it? Is What do we need? It is able to tenonize its prey in order to seize it more easily. What do I need to use to, wait, what? What is the what is the bullet here? What the fuck? Because <laughs> for 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 example, the owner Roy, it says a few iron fragments in your cartridges will do the trick, but here it says nothing. Burning flash? No, I don't think the burning flash does damage. Is it gonna be what? Is it like a type of demon? It says nothing about what you need to use. Uh, it's worth. Wait, why would it not say that? It's okay. It's apparently this is just something you need to learn. Like this is a hidden thing. I guess St. John's word, people are saying it in the in the in the in the chat right here. I don't know why that's not told to the player. It seems like an oversight. Uh, I'm gonna do engraved prayer on there. It doesn't say it, but trust. Okay. Well, I definitely feel like they should tell you because <laughs> it's already hard enough to beat this game. Let it know, and if it doesn't tell you, then I wonder what it is for Raichu. That's also gonna be hidden then. All right, but anyway. It's probably a residual banshee. I'm not entirely sure about that, but we're going to give it a shot. Uh, whoopsie daisy. I need to select that it is a banshee. Uh, banshee. Which, what is banshee? Voices, orbs, footprints, and fingerprints. Let's quickly look around if we can find... There we go. Is it going to be fingerprints? Uh, there are no fingerprints on this, but I should really take some photos as well. I might be tunnel visioning here too hard. So we got a door, we get the date. I'm kind of losing my mind with this uh, pop-up of the, the motion sensor. <laughs> God damn it. All right, could you give us a sign, ghosty pants? Are there any orbs? Maybe it's not a banshee, actually. Maybe I'm wrong. Oh, is there? Oh, there you go. That's the name. Catherine Diaz. Uh, take a photo. Hello? I'm gonna just place one signal. The hell? That's the one I've never seen before. Hello, ghost. How you doing? You having a great time? You ready to get shot? Don't forget the cause of death. I don't even know where the... Where the things are. Are they outside? Let's check if there's a cursed item as well. I'm kinda... Scared because I already got attacked. This is an active ghost. And we're just playing on medium difficulty, remember? Medium- This is like- You want- Don't want to know what hard looks like. Hard is absolutely crazy. Uh, alright, where are you at? You were triggering the motion sensors not stop until like a few seconds ago. Uh, and now you're all shy. What's- What's up? You scared of my gun? You scared I'm gonna exercise you? Oh, there's the cause of death. Okay. Because in this game, you not only need to figure out the ghost, you also need to exercise the ghost. And then on top of that, you can also do side objectives, such as figuring out the date of birth, uh, the... Oh, oh what the hell? What the heck? It's a tiny baby! <laughs> Hello there. Okay, well, I got the ghost photo. Nice. <laughs> That's a new ghost model. I've not seen that one before. Okay, I think the cause of death is going to be... cause of death is going to be war. All right, I didn't get it. I shot into into the middle of nowhere. Death cause is going to be war. We also took a picture of the ghost. We need to use a rune to trap and drain the entity of... Drain the energy of the... Ah! I'm fucked. I'm fucked! What the hell? What? Okay, so wait, when did it become active? Oh, God. It become active at like 50. 
50 sanity is when it becomes active. Okay, is it could that be a banshee? A banshee is at 60, so it can't be a banshee. What activates at 50? Only a demon? So it's gotta be a demon then. But I have the right I have the right thing, but it has to be a demon. That's the only ghost that hunts that early. Okay, so it ha it's 100% a demon. It's a vengeful demon. Well then, fuck me, I guess. Okay, demon. Uh, so let's place new new thing. Okay, at least we figured it out. So there's what? How did you ignore that? That has to be right, no? Maybe it's a residual. Can a demon just attack when they want to? Here's my shotgun shell. No, because the the demon is also weak against St. John's Worth. So I I took the right. I guess the, the banshee scream was not a banshee scream. It was just it was just a regular scream. Sometimes their ghosts can ignore the room. Easiest game of my life. <laughs> All right, well let's go then. I mean, it was a little. That's why. I, that's one of the many reasons I love this game so much. Is that there's so many ways to figure out the ghost. Like it really feels like you're having a back and forth with the ghost because you can use the sanity range. You can use the behavior. You can use. Uh, the evidence, obviously, which is supposed to be the main way, but there are many ways to figure it out. You can also guess and use the the runes. Um, but I should have taken... Oh, it was hallway. I should have filled in something. We still got a hundred bucks there from photos. Look at that. So that's only 480 experience. I mean, look, we only need a thousand more to become neutral. And then I think we need 10,000 to become friendly. So it's definitely going to be a hard... It's gonna be hard to get uh, up to friendly reputation, but maybe if we do hard, it's gonna go a little faster. So let's try hard now. Make sure to always select Nightkeeper. Uh, we're gonna try. I'm gonna. Sh we're going on hard. That was a warm up round. Almost lost my life, but we'll see how it goes. <laughs> God damn, dude. It's very hard. 10,000. Oh my god. Alrighty, well, now now that I'm warmed up again and I've gotten over the initial hurdle, we need to quickly figure out what ghost is this, because if we get another demon, we're going to be dead before we know it, because the ghosts do a lot more damage on heart. Uh, you get a lot more activity on hard. So overall, it's just... It's, it's, a, it's, a, it's a tough time on hard. Anything that could be a cursed item... Because the cursed item spawns as soon as you get into the map, and the way you can find the cursed item is just walking around. If you see something that's, like, glowing, uh, you know you found a cursed item. Which is one of the easiest evidences to find if you're on a small map. If you're on a large map, good luck, you're fucked. You cannot find it on a large map. Like, the, the Super Mansion map, you're never gonna find it. It's impossible. I don't think there's a cursed item. I'm just gonna quickly check out here. Because if there's not, we can rule that out as evidence. Yeah, I don't think there's a cursed item. So I'm going to say uh, no cursed item, which already rules out like half the ghosts. Uh, and now we need to place some, some of the other evidence items, which I didn't even place last round because I was so focused on it being a banshee. I'll place the dot sensors and the footstep as well. Place that right here and here. I don't know if it is in the house. I didn't see the ghost room yet. Oh, it's very quiet. What's my activity look like? Activity is at zero. That's good. I still don't know what, what ammo I need to use against a Raichu. Let's play some motion sensors. One out here. One in here. The doll? Was the doll cursed? That sound. Raichu is the same as Yokai. Okay. How would you supposed to figure out the Banshee? Is a banshee a demon? Is that just common knowledge that I don't know for some reason? Because I'm stupid, I guess. Um, I really don't know how I was supposed to know about the St. John's word. Oh, anyone out here? The female demon. Okay, maybe. I heard footsteps. The garage. There's no orbs. Logos. I think I'm gonna place the dot, one of these dot sensors in the garage. Ah! Okay, well, it's a lost. <laughs> if it grabs you like that, you know it's a loss, so that's good. Oh, it closed the door, perfect. Let me check for fingies. Which it's not yet, it could be later. Also, EMF, which is not a gun. There you go, EMF. 
beep, 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 beep. Hello? It's not leaving this... There we go. See, it's in... That was two? Which is this one. Okay, so it came from back here, maybe. Is it the bathroom? This is walking back and forth between here. It threw something? Ema. Ema three. And a photo. You can actually take more photos now. You can now take... Oh my god, I said two. Sorry, please. You can now take up to ten photos, it said. Oh, I guess you... Wait. Because it doesn't show it in the book. Am I stupid? One. This is still going to be eight, right? I guess you can take more photos. It said added three photos. You can take 11 photos. At least that's what it said in the patch notes. But I'm... I, I Maybe you can take... Fo oh, the activity is going up? What the hell? I thought they added three more photos. I thought so. All right, anyway. I'm going to place this back here. Is this where the ghost is? This lowers activity, by the way. The smudge stick. Okay, the ghost is definitely not here. That's unfortunate. I'm going to have to find the ghost room ASAP. I think it must be outside. Sucks. Oh. I should probably put... Sa oh, it's throwing stuff over here as well. I should probably put St. John Saint Saint John's Worth work in my gun. So if it is a demon, I'm going to be able to fight it. Uh, engraved prayer. Hopefully I'll make some extra bullets instead of losing them. Please. I lost one. I mean, it's not that... Not that many, luckily. Hey, ghost. Where you at? You son of a bitch. Uh, triggered sensor 3, which is out in the... Oh, nice. It walks in here. Perfect. It also triggered a light switch. Which one? With two. It flicked some light switch. I don't know which one, though. Let's check the door. No fingerprints again. Activity is going up, which is problematic for me. Oh, it, 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 every time it does something, the activity spikes. I mean, I guess that makes sense because that's the way activity works. Uh, I'm just going to place this out here. Okay, that, that worked. Nice. Okay, perfect. Team F2. Good. Photos. Definitely outside. Okay, I threw the ball back here. Do I have them on me? I don't have them on me. I need to pick up the sensor. Slowly walking around. Look how good the animations are. This game. Even got like idols. They're like standing around instead of just being like statues. You can also die outside. You can absolutely die outside. Once the ghost starts hunting, you're kind of fucked. Like, there's nothing you can do. Because you... I mean, I, maybe you could activate your shield and then also leave. But if you leave without enough information, the guild will actually still be angry. Like, they'll be like, fuck you, man. We have a reputation to uphold and you... You screwed us over. I don't think it's orbs either. Because I'm not seeing orbs. So I'm going to rule out orbs. Oh. There we go. It wrote this on the ground. I didn't even see it. Walked back here. It walked from over there. Oh, there you go. Okay. Ghost room is right here. You see that glitchy effect? That means to... Did it right on the ground here? Oh, no. That's blood. We can take a photo. And it touched the door again. Oh, God. The activity is going so high, and I have nothing to defend myself anymore. Ever gonna be EMF 5? It's also not fingerprints, right? If this would be fingerprints, it'd be so messed up. What if it's not fingerprints either? And then not orbs? It can't be. I Something is going wrong here. What the hell is going on? I have one incense. Wait! Did they give you three incenses now? Did they do a... They buffed incense? Because I remember you only had two. I guess I'm gonna place it outside here. Come over here. Come and come over to me. You have three now? Okay, nice. It's going down. Oh. Cool. Your room is a basketball court? Wait, they cha They added a room? No, it's called playground. It's called the playground. Nice. Okay, it's down to 30. It's even shorter, but you have three now. I think that's a better way of doing it. Because... Yeah, it was just really hard to hit the... Ooh. Nice. 
and a four. And we got the photo, which is a huge amount of money. Perfect. Look at that. 50 bucks, baby. I'm gonna play it. Turn on this light. I'm gonna place these sensors here. This is such a hard ghost room. Oh, I didn't want to talk to you. Uh. Nine. I'm gonna place this right over here. You're gonna do that. That has to be a photo, right? But it's just incredibly difficult to get. Right, come back here. Come over here. I'm gonna. I'm gonna move the rest. Also in here. We're only at forty activity. Should be okay. Although I am getting nervous. We have no evidence whatsoever. This is a tough ghost. This does not want to tell me anything. There you go. If it's ever going to step in this area, we'll see it. We'll get the footprint evidence. And then hopefully it does uh, dots as well. I guess we stand right here. The activity is going up. Without... Oh, there we go. And there's no footsteps. I mean, this ghost seems to give me absolutely nothing. For no reason. It just kicked this ball. I kicked it again. EMF3. I swear, there's, there's just nothing. It's not EMF. It's not orbs. It's not footsteps. It's not cursed item. It's a nothing ghost. Every ghost has four evidences, by the way. So this is, this is some bullshit right now. That's what it is. Hello, ghost. Oh boy, I am. I am. I'm gonna be in for a tough one. So I haven't seen writing either. Oh, hey, there's. What is this? Oh, this is writing. What the hell is this? Okay, it's writing evidence. I don't know what that supposed to be, but it's definitely evidence. Get the name too. Okay, so we got our first evidence. It's writing. Which, if it is gonna be, like, not first objects and fingerprints, then it has to be an honoroi. Which means... What? What is an honoroi gonna do? It's gonna hunt at 90, so we're safe for a little while, and we need to use, uh, iron as our cartridges. Not fingerprints again? Oh my god! <laughs> what? Oh, so... What does that mean? Can anyone explain me what the patch notes mean then? If it's not this? So the patch notes said, addition of three pictures. Oh! Three possible photos. I see. It's three new types of pictures. I see. <laughs> it's, so the, I mean, that's I guess on me. It's just that sometimes the patch notes are very ambiguous because uh, the patch notes are like translated by Google Translate from French to English, and it doesn't really usually hit that. Doesn't fit that well. CJ, hey, thank you for the 19 months. Okay, um, so it's not this. It's gonna be fingerprints. So it's a ghost, a yokai, an, a kappa, or an ifrit, uh, which is still not gonna be a cursed object, right? Yeah, yeah. The, 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 I at least I had that right. It's also not gonna be orb, so I was correct with that too. Uh, voices hasn't happened at all. EMF5 seems unlikely. Oh, wait, what? Maybe footsteps? I should really look at the list right now. So we have... Let me just leave all this. So we have Ghost, Yokai, Kappa, or Ifrit. I need to... Sorry, CJ, I need to, I'm super focused. Okay, so it's probably not a ghost because it would have already killed me. Uh... Ah! Hello there. Oh, God. Is it gonna hunt me now? Fuck me. Uh, oh, boy. Go, what was it? Yokai cop power ifrit. Yokai ka, Yokai is 90. Kappa is 80. And Ifrit is 70. So Ifrit could hunt now, which will be we need salt. And then for the Yokai and the Kappa, we need bone powder or quartz. Okay. Bone powder or quartz. Is that footsteps? That is not footsteps. I don't think it's gonna be footsteps. It should have already done it, right? Oh no! Oh no! 
Oh god. Okay, so it hunted as soon as it it hunted as soon as it hit 80. I think. Dude, adding the this is so important. Adding the engraved prayer to your bullets is like a way to stay alive. Because it decreases the activity, so you can use the the sanity to figure out the ghost more. I think it hunted at 80, which means it has to be. Um uh kappa which means i need to use uh quartz okay so let's select that quartz it hunted at 79 maybe it rounds up i don't know <laughs> oh we gotta build it back okay let's go i'm gonna try i'm gonna say it's a uh, kappa and we're gonna place this symbol so we can if we can capture it that means it's a kappa Oh, there you go. And it stood there for a while. We're gonna, oh, there you go. Walk into it. It hunted at 77. Okay, maybe it's wrong. What would it be then if it hunted at 77? It would be a ghost? That's crazy because then it didn't hunt for 20. I can't believe that. What? What the hell was that noise? The voices? Ifrit hunts at 90, right? Oh, Ifrit hunts at 70. Okay. So it's weakest to salt. Okay, never mind then. But it got captured by my symbol just now, didn't it? Is that voices? Uh. What the fuck? Was that voices? Because if it's voices, it's gotta be a kappa. The giggle is voices? Then it has to be. But how the fuck is it not EMF? Or how was it EMF? That makes no sense. Are you back here? Come on, attack me! You coward! Don't be a coward. Ah! Don't, be a coward. don't ever say don't be a coward. <laughs> I knew this, but I thought I could just do it for one time. Come on! <laughs> Jesus Christ, dude. The ghosts are not okay with that. Holy shit. Okay, I need to know what ghost this was. Was it a kappa? Who was right? It was a ghost? It was the last one I would expect. What? It didn't hunt for 20 sanity? Okay, well, I guess I just got played by the ghost. That was weird. Okay, uh, let that be a first-hand lesson that you should never... <laughs> Say, don't be a coward. Not when you're in a good position, you think you have the ghost, just wait it out. Don't ever do it. It's gonna get you killed every time. I've literally never been like, oh, don't be a coward, actually help me there. I've always been like, oh, well, fuck me. <laughs> yeah, okay, so what was ghost? Wait, what was the evidence for ghost? I quickly need to see it, because I got played right there. Ghost is, um, so it was gonna be, it's gonna be dots, okay, and voices. So it was voices, the giggle? Okay. Well, anyway. We learned something. There's blood right there. I would like to get the photo. So what's brutal about this game is that not only do you not get money when you die, you lose money when you die, and not only do you not get experience when you die, you lose experience when you die. So you have to be... A lot better, like, you have to survive a whole lot more than you die. Otherwise, you're going to be... Like, if you die 50% of the time, you're going to lose money overall. Which is brutal, but it is actually one of the reasons I love to play this game so much. Because it it doesn't mess around. Like, you have to get good or go home, basically. That's that's the way the game... That's what the game's telling you. You had to get good or you get out. All right, uh, I don't see anything. No cursed item. There's the thing. Oh, God. Let's go. Take a photo. I think you can just take it up close like this as soon. Yeah, nice. Uh, drowned. Or drowning. Well, the ghost was here then. Does this give EMF? Oh, four? Give EMF four for a second. Let's place the dots in here. Dots in this over here. Dots right there. And then I'll place one footstep right here. It flicked the light switch and something just exploded. 
Okay, it flicked this light switch. That's perfect. Because that means we can check for both EMF and fingerprints. Which is not going to be fingerprints. Not yet, at least. We, we saw from last game it can take a really long time before you get fingerprints to work. They definitely reduced the audio of the foot or the writing. I cannot hear it anymore. Like you used to be able to hear the writing across the room, but they made it a lot. They made it fade out a lot faster. Um, you can't hear it from as far anymore. Oh, ghost. Got anything for me? I guess I'm going to place some. some door. Perfect. It dinged. It threw something at this door. Nice. Team at five? Yes. Good shit. I did, did I take a photo of the door? I don't think I did. I did not. Okay. No fingerprints, but we do have EMF. Team at five. So we have a not, not a ghost this time. It turned this on. No fingerprints again. I mean, I don't know how many times you need to rule out fingies before. Like, I don't know what the chance is of fingerprints. Oh, te television, please. There's a fingerprint on the TV. What the hell? <laughs> Does that take the noise clicks? Nice. I didn't even know you could do that. Look at that. I, I think I actually have seen that in the past. How did I think of it? Okay, so we got fingerprints as well. So it's a Kappa Revenant Raichu or if. Oh, no, it could be a Raichu. Uh-oh. Ah! It's a tiny child! <laughs> it's just Christmas. Okay. Uh, well, hello there. I got the photo, though. Look at this! We got a perfect game in terms of photos! Nice. Okay, I need to be careful now. Uh, we, we need to... I need to craft something. I'm just gonna go, what's the earliest hunting ghost? I'm gonna say salt. Uh, salt. We're just gonna guess it's a ghost real quick because I need to add the engraved prayer to my bullets as fast as possible. So if it hunts, we can decrease the activity. Because otherwise, when it hunts, you're just fucked. I lost three bullets! Are you fucking with me? <laughs> God damn it. Okay, whatever then. Um, what's your favorite room? Is it this back room? Is it my best friend, the Raichu? No, because it's not, it's not giving enough activity, right? The Raichu makes your activity go crazy way faster than this one. All right, let's see. So what are we dealing with? We're either footprints would be Rev, writing would be Kappa Ifrit, dots would be Raichu. Where are you at, my friend? Where are you chilling? Place these. I need to place this. Please come over here. Nice. Okay, it's here. It's walking away, though. Oh, it's right here. I'm going to place two. Holy shit, look at the activity. Meryl! <laughs> nice. Oh. Hi there. Give me more fingerprints. It really... Did they make fingerprints more rare? I feel like they did. I could used to show up a whole lot more. I gotta go around the map for writing now. Because you can't... You can't rely on the sound anymore. You have to actually go look for it now. Oh boy. Need to get some of these heart missions. How the fuck are we ever gonna get friendly with this guild, man? <laughs> this game is insanely hard. Just never say don't be a coward is like rule number one from now on. Unless you like just wanna get it over with and die. I don't think it's cursed item. I'm gonna say no cursed item. So it's not a ghost. Wait. Oh no, what was it not? It's not a revenant, okay? So it's a couple Raichu or a couple Raichu or Ifrit. So let's see which, which in which order these are gonna hunt. The uh, Kappa's gonna hunt at 80, Raichu's gonna hunt at 75, and the Ifrit is gonna hunt at 70. So the Ifrit is gonna hunt the earliest. Uh, it's over here, right? It was here a lot. Place more of these. Can you beep any of those? Because you're not beeping right now. No beeps. Water, thunder, or fire. Maybe the ghost room. Maybe it is outside? No, it's not a cursed item. Man, imagine it was just an easy revenant. That would be very useful. It's gotta be outside. There's not, not enough happening in there. Another outside ghost. 
My favorite, as you know. I love outside ghosts. Oh. Go out here. Not orbs. Is there a multiplayer in this? Yes, there is. Um, there's actually a really interesting that I interesting system in this game that I don't know if I'm fully a fan of, but they have shared health. So if anyone dies, the whole team dies, basically. <laughs> Which does kind of mean that if you want to like teach the game to a new player, uh, you like you're gonna it's gonna hurt because <laughs> if they die because they're new to the game, everyone's gonna lose. Which, losing in this game is super punishing. Because if you die, you lose experience, you lose money. Like, it's it's a bad time. You don't want to die. Alright, I don't know where the frick this ghost is. It's extremely quiet. I would love to play the terrible trio in this game, by the way. I'm freaking going crazy for this game. Well, here we go. It's p triggered sensor 1. Wait, what? Was that out here? Okay, so it came into the map then? And now it walked out again? It's not leaving any... Okay, I need to bring this... Wait, where's my... Oh, I didn't place it yet. I didn't place the sensor. Let's do it next week? If you... Time next week? Let's do it. Let's freaking go. I'm gonna have to get the new map before next week, because CJ is gonna die over and over again, lose all my money. <laughs> hey, that that's what I did when I started out. I kept dying over and over again. Everyone hated me in this game. Because when you die, the reputation goes down and the guilds are like, fuck you, I don't want to sell you anything. <laughs> Alright, come on, ghost. At least we kept the activity pretty low. We can kind of chill. Which, being alive feels like a victory in this game. Like, just being here and looking around and not being actively attacked or pushed to figure out the ghost quick is already a victory in and of itself. You really gotta give me some dots though. Did they make the evidence rarer? I feel like I'm either being worse or they they did maybe I'm just getting outside ghosts. Maybe that's the main difference. But I really feel like I'm having a hard time getting anything right now. Oh Okay, so I mean we already know it's CMF. Dang it. Can't wait to die on purpose. Sounds like the perfect game for me. Oh uh, uh, <gasps> gonna kill us all. I'm gonna say it's playground again for no reason other than I hate this ghost. Oh, there is writing. Aha. Okay, maybe it is the playground. Nice. That's three evidence, right? I'm full. Of course I am. Uh, writing. It's a cup or an ifrit. Which I could at that point just start guessing. Do we know it's a lost? We don't know what it is, right? I'm guessing it's a lost. Every ghost is a lost, so it's gonna be a lost kappa. Uh, if it was at 70, right? Uh, sensor one triggered, it went into the map. If it is what now? Is salt. And kappa is, um, wraith, which wraith is quartz. <laughs> I need to really start, like, memorizing the. Uh, memorizing the, the bullet type you have to use because looking it up is extremely annoying. <laughs> so what do we need? Yeah, it didn't grab me yet. That's true. Uh, if it is, it will be voices for Kappa and if it will be dots, which it hasn't shown dots at all. But that doesn't mean a thing because sometimes it can just not do it for because it says fuck you. But voices has also not happened. And voices is easier to get, I think. It could be residual if it doesn't do anything. We could try residual Ifrit, because Ifrit is the early hunter, which means we're going to put salt in our thing, right? Sure, let's put salt in there. Oh, wait, I already have salt. Oh, nice. Perfect. Well, then, I'm just going to place this out here. Where are you at, ghost? Place it at the door. That's usually where the ghost gets by. Need to see you. A friend. Uh, no. This is one, like, quiet ghost, I gotta say. Probably the least active ghost I've ever seen. Oh, it turned this light on? Hi there. Ding dong? Is that outside? I think that was in the backyard over here. 
Did it throw this? Oh! Why did it do an evil laughing noise? Hi there. It didn't spin, so I might be wrong. Fuck, I wanted to see if it was spinning, but I, I shot too late. Okay, I'm gonna think it's not... It's either not a... Ifrit. Oh, it did dots in my face! It is an Ifrit! Okay, so it's gonna be lost then. Did you see the dots? It, it was it was underneath the journal. Okay. I'm gonna say it's lost then. Let's go. That was a battle. Dude, can we get some inside ghosts, please? The outside ghosts are kicking my ass. I'm not gonna say don't be a coward, but you're baiting me into doing it. I could say hello, right? Hello gonna kill me? No, right? I'm surrounded by cruise by this. I'm gonna say hello. 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 Oh. Got him. Got him. Hello. Hello. Oh, it ignored that one. I only have four bullets. Come on, please tell me this is. I mean, it has. It has to be the correct ghost type, which I have. Come on, man. Come on, step into my thing. It's really hard to beat the game without using these. Oh. If you triggered it again, I'm shooting right away. That's the wrong answer, you piece of garbage! Damn it. How have I hit- did- am I using the wrong bullet type? I must be. How is it not dead? It's weak to sodium. Am I not using that? I am using salt. What the hell? <laughs> How is it? Okay, well, fuck me, I guess. It's a very tanky. Oh. Let's go! And it was a loss. Nice. So we have full confirmation. All right, let's go. Uh, and wait a minute. I thought I saw the date on the wall somewhere. Wasn't the date somewhere? Uh, on this wall, maybe? I swear I've seen the date somewhere. I need that for my for my objective. Is it... To get money? It's gotta be over here on the wall, right? Uh, not there. Maybe over here? Yes, there it is. 1924. Alright. Uh, so with that, easy game. Uh, playground's probably wrong. It might be something else, but I'm just gonna do that. I should've... Oh! What does this mean? Use a rune to trap and drain the energy of the entity. Minimum 10 points. Does this mean letting it spin or something i'm not entirely sure uh anyway easy peasy you need to let the ghost sit in a room the rune actually deals damage i didn't know that all right how much money are we gonna get that was a hard mission i died one time i lost like 400 and now we win one time and we get 800 okay so you do if you do like a good mission that you actually win you don't lose as much or you don't like, you make more than you lose, which is good. 1,300, by the way. Holy shit, I'm almost level 7. Uh, and we are almost neutral with this guild, which is going in the right direction. Now, we have warmed up on uh, on that map. Let's go to the media map, which you can actually earn even more money on the media map. Now, obviously, it's going to make the game a whole lot more difficult. We're going to give it our best shot. Um, the lights were off again. Yeah. Sometimes you can have EMF. With the apparition? I don't know. Alrighty. Oh, baby. I am ready. There's blood immediately. This map has, like, a basement. It has an attic. It's the... It has... It has everything. Everything you need for a creepy ghost house. I love the outside noises in the game. The, the menacing walking around because I don't want to trigger the... Don't want to trigger the the ghost by sprinting. I place that one. Now that you get like a global notification of this, it's actually going to help me a lot to figure out where the ghost starts. And I think where the ghost starts is kind of the ghost room, because whichever sensor it's going to trigger first, it's going to give me a lot of information. Can I please place this on the wall? Hello, hello. Uh, excuse me. Can't place it on the wall. What? 
Is this not real? Is bug? Can't place it. Um, something is. I don't understand. I motion sensor doesn't work. Well, I guess I'm just gonna leave it. That works. I am dreaming. Wake up. Can only place. You can place three. I should. Yeah, I don't know what happened. Maybe I should pick the one. I think I broke it. Wait, I can't pick up motion sensors. Oh, there we go. Yeah, I, I should have left that one because I can't play. I don't know what I did, but I bugged out my motion sensors. I can't place them anymore. All right. Oh. Wait, I'm so confused. What's going on? Oh, there you go. What? There we go. What the hell? <laughs> Why couldn't I place them for so long? I'm so confused. All right, there we go. Easy peasy. Okay, let's continue our search for the... For the cursed item now. They reduced the audio of the clock. That was one of the most annoying things of this map. The audio of the clock was like way too loud, so you could hear it all all over the map. So oh, much better. Okay, where the heck is this ghost? Is it outside again? It seems like the ghosts are less mobile than they used to be. They used to kind of search you out. Like they used to come to you. Now you have to actively find the ghost. It's already done some things, because it's nine activity. So it's active somewhere. You out, you out, outside somewhere, you sneaky bitch. All right, see ya, CJ. Checking the basements. PP basement time. Hi there, how are you doing? Come on, please. Uh, okay, we found the, the cause of death. But I don't think that, that's, oh, never mind, it's right here then. Because it only shows up if the ghost is close enough. Porter? Oh god. <laughs> That's fun. Uh, death cause torture. Oh, nice. Oh, what the fuck? There it is. It's a basement ghost. All right, perfect. It's a basement ghost. Favorite room is basement. We're gonna have to stay down here. Also place an activity thing. Wait, where did it go? I still managed to break the game all the time. <laughs> it disappeared. I hope it's still here. It went invisible. Oh, fuck me. <laughs> What's going on, man? Why do I keep doing that? Can you please go into the basement? So you trigger the first sensor? Which meant you went outside? Why did you go outside? You're supposed to be in the basement. Damn it. I mean, I could leave this over here. Because if it's ever going to walk upstairs. I think this is kind of useless, but I'll place it anyway. If it triggered that sensor, it must mean it's out here. So what I'm supposed to do. Just come back to your ghost room. There we go. Nice. Okay. Clicks. Perfect. Does that give fingers? Nice. Oh, our first evidence. Fingerprints. And it's already 30 activity. This is bad. I really need you to go to your ghost room so I can trigger. I need to take one of the sensors. So I can place it in the basement. Uh, it's doing stuff down there. Did you just close the door up here? I'm pretty sure I left this door open. Yep, there you go. Turn the light on as well. Okay. So do we just place this here then? Downstairs, you. I'm being, I'm being played. I need, I need to put the thing in the. Just go. Just do basic in this. I don't really care. Just put salt in there. Whatever. We need the engraved prayer, or we're gonna be doomed.
Oh, nice. Let's go. Okay. Uh, writing. It's the same situation as last time. Can you please just go to the ghost room? I have all my stuff set up there. You're making this much harder than it has to be. Okay. Well, at least I reduced the activity a little bit. I guess I should place these up here. Sensor 3 triggered, which is up here. Alrighty, ghost. Give me a sign. We're looking for footprints. Sensor 2. That one goes into the basement. I'm guessing it's finally going home. Finally going down. Rapid tapping sound. What sound? There were no orbs, right? What's it, do? it just went out the basement again. Can you please just be in your ghost room? Those are one. That's all the way outside. Oh, God. Well, it's coming. Oh, God. What's the bad thing? What the heck? Oh god, I'm dead. I'm dead. I'm dead as hell. I have like five health, man. Okay, so it starts hunting at 60. Ah! It's a, it's a ghost. That's the only ghost that can hunt this early. Okay, so uh, I'm using the right bullets, right? It's a ghost. I'm just gonna say it's lost. Oh my god. Shield. Yeah, I really need to like press the shield. I think it has to be ghost. Ghost assault, which means I'm using the right type. Nice. Okay. We just need to capture. Did I get a new photo, by the way? Phone. Let's go. Uh, which I don't think I've gotten that before. Phone. Twenty bucks. Use holy water. Oh my god. Oh, I did the... Wrap it with a rune. Okay, push back the entity with the burning flash. Take a photo with the... I, I, should I really do these things? I gotta try. I'm gonna capture it. I'm gonna take a photo. This is so greedy. But I have already shot it many times, right? You can't heal in this game. I feel like there should be some kind of way for you to be able to heal. Especially in multiplayer. Like, imagine your teammate just gets like hit by the ghost a few times because they're bad and then like the whole mission is fucked up i have no pictures left god damn it <laughs> i'm stupid oh here we go i was supposed to oh i did it never mind okay good stuff good stuff push it back with the burning flash hey let's go holy shit that was a battle okay uh it wasn't spinning but whatever it's fine I can't take any more photos. I already took them all. I need the year of birth. Is that somewhere? Isn't that upstairs? Yeah, it was upstairs. All right, perfect. Little extra cash. Uh, I did do two objectives, and I did the ghost room as well as the death, the uh, cause of death. So this, and and we're playing on a bigger map on the highest difficulty. This should be like two thousand or something. It should be a lot of money. I'm glad. <laughs> glad I didn't die there. That was very, very iffy. Residual, you think? It didn't do lost stuff. I'm just gonna do lost, whatever. Maybe it's wrong, but... I'm just gonna stick to my guns. Alright, give me the big bucks. Was it? It was a residual. Alright, whatever. <laughs> Small savings? I got an achievement? Also, I, I leveled up. That's when your character spins. So, we now got it neutral, but we need an additional... <laughs> 9,000 experience, which is only nine games, which you can realistically do in like two hours if you're a little fast. So you can easily get this. It's just very important not to die. But look at that, almost 2,000 bucks. Uh, Cause we need to save up 2,000, right? Uh, and we can buy something new. 
we can now buy the craft enhancement, which means that we are gonna get more or like losing ammo is gonna be rare, which is actually really important. I'm still gonna buy this even though we won 2000. I feel like this is important and then I have less to lose. I'm just gonna do it. I'm gonna do it because I feel like we're gonna make 1400 or 14,000 in the in the time it's gonna take us to get our experience up. Uh, so let's do that. Bullets are very important. And just keep going to this map. Because that was actually a faster mission, I feel like, than the previous missions on the little house. We had a lot of bad luck on the little house. And we're actually winning. I mean, I died one time because I said, don't be a coward like an idiot. But um, let, let's test. Let's test how the... If I immediately craft salt and engraved prayer, am I not going to lose anything now? Because I'm better? Let's go. All right. We can craft infinite bullets now. That is huge. I mean, I don't know if we can, but maybe it was just a one-time lucky thing. Who knows? This is one right here. Set up. I want to see the new... Oh. Is that a ghost event? What the fuck was that? <laughs> All right. Well, you're here. Oh, there. What are my objectives? I need to look at them. Uh, push the entity back. Oh my god. No, 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 no. What the fuck? Is it Ventral? Or what? I guess it's Ventral. That sounded... That was an insta-hunt. Excuse me. I'm guessing that's a Ventral ghost. <laughs> Jesus Christ. It came from the basement? Alright, that was a little spooky. I think. I'm the Ghostbusters. Ghostbusters with shotguns. Aha, uh -huh, the light is on down here. Definitely seems like it. That was very quick, but that's because it's a Vengeful. Vengefuls can hunt at any time. So is that riding? Wait, is it Ghostman? Oh! oh my god. Okay, well, I did the objective. <laughs> Jesus Christ. Okay. Uh, use the... Okay, we need to trap it. So we need to get the ghost correct. And then trap it. That was a little... A little spooky. Nice, we get both of these. It's definitely in the basement. you have any fingerprints? Hi. Is this door? Oh, hi, Mark. Uh, so to select the... Favorite room basement, not bathroom. Giraffe, thank you for the 11 months. Okay, we need to be on our guard because this ghost is going to be a tough one. If it's going to just start hunting randomly all the time. Ooh. Down here, I know it. Give me footsteps. We haven't gotten footsteps. At all. Nice. Turn on the light switch. And it closed the door. This is prime time for fingerprints. A photo. Oh, that was a door photo? Didn't I take... Oh, whatever. Uh, I thought I touched the light switch too, but I'm probably too late now. I am. Oh, ghost, you haven't touched, uh, you haven't left any fingerprints yet. Nor do you have any orbs. It could be a cursed item because this map is a lot bigger, so it's much harder to get the cursed item. The upper, is it a separate room? No, a basement is just one. Oh, the laundry is a different room, yes. But I don't, maybe it's this, who knows? You're right, it could be this. The laundry room. Let's place this here then. Hello? I heard you write. Is that another writing? Quickly go upstairs to see if there's a cursed item. Ah, there is! Nice. Shit, and I hear noise flicks. Just turn on the television. Is that writing? Go, 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 go. Is this? Fuck. I heard running again. Bitch. Here. Prince. 
It's your time for fingerprints, man. You better not be a fingerprints ghost. We got cursed item first. Yes. Hey, Patricia, what's up? Is your right on the wall here somewhere? What is this sound? Is the computer? What the heck? Or is this a television downstairs? Okay, it's going down into the basement again. Turn off the light again with no fingerprints. I'm starting to believe it's we can rule our fingerprints, but I've been wrong before. Behind me. Just show me the the distortion effect. What did you just throw? What was that? It would draw, what the fuck? Look at all this activity. <laughs> Excuse me. Hello? What the fuck? There's nothing? Is it upstairs? Does it go through floors? It might go through floors. Hi. Lots of footsteps. Those were not mine. Also, the activity is going up. I'm making me nervous. The fact that we can craft more bullets now is gonna make a world of difference. It triggered this one. Aha! You are right! It is the laundry room. Good stuff. So now basement, laundry room instead. Uh, but we still don't know what the ghost is. No orbs. Ever gonna give EMF? Starting to believe it's not. Okay, I don't, I'm gonna say it's not fingerprints. If this is fingerprints, I've been scanned. Because I've gotten so many... Is that EMA 5 for split seconds? I mean, many people are saying this, I could go for it. Then it's a wraith or a demon? If you say so, I'm gonna believe you. Close the door, please. So what do we have then? Wraith or demon? Well, I don't think it's a demon because a demon would have already hunted. So it's got to be a wraith, which means it's going to be uh, quartz, right? Silica is quartz, I think. All right, I'm going to guess wraith, uh, which means quartz. Are we going to guess? Are we going to get more bullets now? I didn't hear him a five. I mean, I mean, either. Okay, we only lost one bullet there, which means we, in total, made one. One bullet. You can still lose bullets, even when you're like this. Um, even when you have one upgrade. But there's more upgrades to collect, right? What do I gotta do? I gotta... If this is correct, let's see if it's gonna spin. Because then I can do the draining of the rune objective. Oh, oh god. It's not spinning. It's... What the fuck? But it did get caught for a while. It's not spinning. It, bl it blocked off that area. I can't leave. What? It did dodge! <laughs> what the hell? Okay, then. So it's not this ghost. So uh, let's get rid of this. We just have footprints. And then if it's EMF, it would be a demon then. Was it? When does it? Maybe it is a demon. Maybe we... So that would be salt again then, right? Oh no, St. John's word. Yeah, let's do that. Oh god. Oh god. Oh, what the hell? <laughs> the dots came for me. <laughs> okay. Um, yeah, I think it's gonna be a demon, which we really need to change the bullet. Oh! oh! That happened last time with a demon too, right? What the fuck is going on, man? Excuse me! Stop it! This is terrifying. Okay, we didn't lose any. So bad. I am going to die. I'm doomed! What am I gonna do? What the fuck? Okay, this is good. We're actually hitting it. Fuck. 
I shouldn't have shot. I have two bullets. I'm gonna craft more. Please. Upgrade. Save me. Come on. Let's go! <laughs> Let's go! <laughs> Alright, I'm gonna do it again. Come on, we can do more. Keep crafting, baby. Okay, that was nothing. Oh no, he cancelled it. Wait, that's bad. That's real bad? How is he not hunting? I don't think this is demon. I, I think the EMF was wrong, guys. Poltergeist or shapeshifter? Poltergeist would be 65, which seems to be about perfect, but that would have the same de weakness as demon. Or shapeshifter would be quartz, which would be also 65. So it could be either. Fuck me. What would shapeshifter be? That would be writing and orbs. And poltergeist would be footprints and voices. I'm gonna lose. I'm gonna die. I'm done for. Writing on the wall upstairs. Here we go. Above me? What's going on? It's coming. Oh, oh good God. <laughs> okay, okay, okay. That was we got a smudge, right? Yeah, 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 yeah. Sorry. I'm 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 just terrified. <laughs> okay, smudge it. Please tell me this is gonna hit. It's not hitting. Come over here, man. As soon as it hits, I place more. Why are you not in your ghost room? Piece of garbage. Come over here. Yes. Yes. It's here. Place. Place them all. Just go ham. Holy shit. Look at that. <laughs> Let's go. Okay. Down to 25. We got a little bit of breathing room. Oh my God. Okay. Okay. Do we have orbs? It's dots. Dots. And it's. We, that's the only thing we have. Let's check for orbs. And it touched this again. Could it be fingerprints? I feel like fingerprints would be so messed up. I don't think it's orbs. Yeah, you have three, but they are shorter, but that's actually better because you can use one of them to figure out if the ghost is in the room and then you can quickly place the others to get more. So did this noise fix? I really think we can rule out fingerprints. Oh, of course we can. Fuck, I'm stupid. <laughs> Ignite, thank you for the prime. Uh, I would also almost say you can rule out orbs, honestly. Uh, what would this... So that would not be EMF5. That would be footprints. Is there writing upstairs anywhere? Any writing? Maybe outside. Kitty. Hi there. You're over here. You coming to kill me? Walking down here. Lots of creepy sounds. I don't think it's writing. I haven't... I mean, we heard the scream, right? Is the scream voice? Because if it is, it's a polter. But that means we're using the right bullets. Because it's since John work. I'm going to craft again. Please don't lose me. I only have three bullets. I need him. Fuck! Come on! I upgraded! Why are you so rude? I don't see orbs. I'm gonna... Come on. We have to try. I can't kill him with two. I need more. I need, like... Let's go! <laughs> the gamble, man. There were orbs? Oh, there are orbs! You're right! Okay, never mind. We're wrong. Oh no, oh no, oh no. Use the shield. X. Oh. Okay. The shield. The shield saved me. I used it! That's the first time I ever used the shield. Let's go. Okay. So there's orbs, which means it's a shapeshifter if it's not EMF. The first time ever I've done it. Are you proud of me? Uh, I'm gonna say it's 
probably i mean unless you guys really did see it's a, oh yeah because it, it changed ghost model right that was a different ghost model than the last time it's shape-shifting wait a minute i'm not using my brain of course it is <laughs> it's been changing the ghost model this whole time <laughs> I really got that's because this game is so damn fucking scary you can like use your brain because <laughs> it's too spooky all right so that's quartz it changed because it was like a butcher thingy before okay i didn't lose bullets that time which is good this is bad though how the fuck am i gonna do this i need more motion sensors oh boy or we could hunt it outside. We could let it hunt. I could just... I think letting it hunt is gonna be the answer here. But we, we need to craft more. Craft one more, please. Just, 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 just this once. Just give me three. Nothing. Just a rune. I already used all my runes. I'm farming. They get mad we need to get a hundred. I mean, I could keep sprinting to try and get a hundred. But I need to craft more. Like, I don't think I can kill it with four. It's obsidian? Oh my god, I'm 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 getting scammed. Is it? Silica? Silica's quartz, right? Is it? Wait, what? Why are people saying it's obsidian? I'm confused. What is obsidian? Silica is all, it's always been quartz. I'm pretty sure. Okay, let me, I have to, unless, with two bullets? I already shot it, no, but I didn't ever shoot it with the right type of bullet, so I have to, I have to. If I lose, then I lose, whatever. We're back up, we're back up to four. Is four enough? Four bullets enough? I feel like six is gonna be enough, but we're gonna try it with four. Right, I'm gonna sprint now. To try and get it to 100, because that's an objective, right? Yeah, reach 100. I don't know if this is gonna work, but... Uh -huh. oh! It just spawned on top of me! What am I supposed to do? <laughs> that's such bullshit! What the fuck? <laughs> that is so fucked up. <laughs> What the hell are you supposed to do? <laughs> I feel like may I feel like there gotta be like at least some rate. I we already know this was a we know what go we don't have to waste any money. That was just a shame. I, I, I think the ghost just spawns where it is. So if it's on top of you, you're like I don't think there's anything you can do if the ghost starts hunting on top of you, it just hits you. Cause that's been happening like it happens sometimes. It's especially annoying because there I made the ghost super angry using a bunch of runes. So when it it just had a lot of damage right there it happens though all right well anyway uh we're back because that's the thing with a game like you gotta learn how to play and same with phasmo i've played it for 2000 hours there's still times where i lose in phasmo what's important to know is like could you have done it better could you have played better to avoid what happened and i feel like right there i mean i think the answer is no because i was like to prevent dying from the ghost spawning on top of you, you need to be out in the open so you can, like... Like, it has to really spawn on top of you in order to kill you. Because if you're out in the open, you can just, like, run the other way and shoot it. Because if you're in a close quarters, it's gonna be much harder to flick your shotgun at it. Yeah, that was just unlucky. Anyway, you got any, any cursed objects for me? Not the face this time. Molly, PP Dole as well. What you guys doing today? I still think this map is like, cause the thing with this map, why it might not even be harder than Little House, is because there's so much more inside space. What's really hard is when you get an outside ghost. It doesn't matter what map it is, like if it's on this map or if it's on uh, Little House, an outside ghost is just really hard. But because Little House is smaller, that means that there is more chance of the ghost to be an outside ghost which honestly makes this map almost easier and i'm gonna place the first sensor over here yes this setup seems to be doing just fine second one is in the basement the third one's outside 
Which it might be. Oh, there's blood right there. Might be outside this time because nothing's at. Oh, uh, Orbeez! Let's go. Weird stationary orb. So we found the ghost room. It's this, which is what now? Is that a cursed item, by the way? Um, that is just garden. It has to be garden. Um, give a room garden. No, it's not a favorite object. It's just, it's just an orb. Oh, and there you go. 100%. Okay. So that's, uh, that's an outside ghost, which I just talked about how that is going to be really difficult. But we'll see. At least I found it early. Because the main reason outside ghosts are so hard is because you never know. Like, you're just like, why is this ghost not doing anything? <clears throat> Valor, thank you for the six months. Alright, if you ever want to go inside the house, you need to... Because what was a shapeshifter? Shapeshifter wasn't footprints. Alright, he goes. Give us a sign. I know you're out here. Orbeez. Orbeez still here. Not dots. We're writing. Or, uh... Fingerprints. 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 And it's gonna be hard on this. Like, if it's outside. Because there's not much to touch. Could you help me with this real quick, ghost? Could you come over here? Hello? Hello. I need your help. Walking. Obsidian is called volcanic glass for a reason. It's similar. Is there any ghost that's weak to obsidian? I don't think I've ever used obsidian. I don't think there is. I think obsidian is an unused... <laughs> an unused uh, weakness. Shapeshifter? No. That, no, we just established that the shapeshifter... Unless it's... Wait... They just lied to you? Wait, are you kidding me? Because the the Wraith is weak to Quartz. Wait, I really don't understand. Is this a translation issue or is it the same in French? Why? It's just a wrong description? Why? Because I really... That's like the one thing. I mean, there's two things I really feel like they should change in this. Uh, three things. The ghost spawning on top of you is extremely annoying. I feel like that should change. The... Um, Health being shared in multiplayer is annoying, and the unnecessary convo like the unnecessary vagueness of the weakness of each ghost. Like, why? Why? What does that add to the game? Like, there's really oh, nice. I'm choking. No, you were supposed to choke your Because there's really no way you like. There's no way you can figure out what type works. Like, there's no gameplay here. Like, if you could do some kind of research to figure out, I guess you just look it up online or something. But it's just unnecessary. Like, I don't understand why they say silica and not just the, 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 what it is. And like sodium, like we're not, we're not the Jimmy Neutron nerd in here. Like, actually, it's uh, sodium, blah, 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 blah. No one gives a shit. Just tell me what it is. We're playing a video game. Yeah, like, I mean, here, I guess, like, this is just some lore. It has the same sensitivity as werewolves. Like, then you're gonna know, oh, it's gonna be something with silver. Like, that is, like, as much as I as I can, can handle. I can't handle... Like, I don't understand this. Like, this type of stuff. Wraith and Kappa share the same weakness. Like, okay, I'll go over here now. Like, it's just annoying. And there's just no reason for it to be this way. Like, it's just... Because games are supposed to be fun, and I feel like this is just annoying for no reason. That's just my opinion, though. Maybe people disagree. Uh, can you please come over here? I need you to do this, man. I need you- You were just here doing a ghost event and everything? And now you do nothing? You son of a bitch? Okay, I need to put the thing in my, uh... Bullets, by the way. Brave prayer, just in case you get an early hunt. At least in John's sport is clear. Yeah, at least that one. But like Banshee doesn't even show up. Apparently Banshee is also St. John's sport, but it doesn't even say it. Banshee doesn't have a weakness in the book. Hey, Mary, what's up? It's just unnecessary. Can you come out here? You're so close to me. Weird. 
Why are you not here? Why are you not coming? Just itchy. Obsidian consists of about 70% of non crystallized uh, silica. Actually, I'm sorry. <laughs> I'm being rude now, but it's it's so annoying. If there's one thing that tilts me to no end, it's fucking idiots in the YouTube comments being like, well, you should have known this. Like, it's people reverse engineering based on that they already know the answer because we figured it out through painstaking like blood sweat and tears and then people go like with the, with hindsight being 2020 they go like well you should have known that it was obviously that because as everyone knows silic like obsidian is made for 70 percent out of silica so obviously it's that it's the same thing when i was complaining about the patch notes being vague about some like some of the wording which is it's objectively true that the patch notes are just french put into google translate therefore they're sometimes ambiguous or vague like it's it's just a fact this is how the patch notes are made the dev is french he types the patch notes in french then he puts them into into google translate and that is what we get obviously that's not gonna be ideal patch notes. also i just turned on every light in the map what the hell was that did you see that Wait, that, that looked like it was EMF5 for a second. I, I can agree. But I, Oh, there you go. Nice, you got fingerprints. But like... <laughs> Did I get switched? Nice. Oh, boy. Um, EM, No, no, not EMF5, but fingerprints. Okay, Spirit, Banshee, or Raichu. Okay, we can actually get a ba Banshee this time. But the Banshee can insta-kill you, by the way. Um... We saw EMF? Yeah, I think that was just a reflection. I think that's what we saw. You can just see, like, a... There was no sound on it. Oh. Hi there. Yeah, why did it turn on all the lights? Sorry. That was kind of crazy. Are we looking for cursed objects? I didn't check this area. Because I'm not, like... That's just people arguing in such bad faith. Like, is one of the easiest ways to spot, like, people that are super annoying to be around. Sorry for if you've ever made a comment like this. But, like, if your instinct, like, when someone is, like, making a good faith complaint, like a, like a, hey, this was vague for me. If you go, like, well, actually, if I take the literal definition of this word and I take the most... Like, weirdest assumptions that, that like, you wouldn't usually do. But if I, like, there's a 10% chance this could have been interpreted the way that it is, like, actually is. Therefore, 100% of the people should be as smart as I am. And you're stupid. It's like, okay, dude. I guess you're very smart. I, do people feel, like, a sense of superiority when they're, like, going against the grain? Like, I don't understand. Like, aren't we all... <laughs> Trying to make the game better, and I feel- And then- Oh, let's go, it's a- it's a lost. Like- Wait, it's a shapeshifter again! Wait, what? That was a different model than before. Before it was the upside down head guy. Wait, what? But it's not a shapeshifter. What? Wait, huh? Is this just a thing that they always do? Is it because I have it clicked? Oh, but wait, huh? <laughs> I'm so confused. Because that was, that was like a tiny goblin. Spirit, Banshee, Raichu. I need to see. Spirit, Avery Spirits is very close to the ghost. Your orb is particularly visible. You can't miss it. Here, like this. Some lummies say are effective. Like this is some Latin term for crushed sage, but why? Just tell me crushed sage. It really doesn't make my experience better that I have to use Google to figure out how the fuck your game works. <laughs> God damn it! Fuck! <laughs> anyway, um. Like, <laughs> the fact that you have to look up a walkthrough to play the game, not a good sign. <laughs> I love the game. That's why I'm critical, because it should be. Like, improvements can always be made. I think it's the spirit, because the orb is, like, constantly visible. Look at this. Like, the orb never disappears. I'm gonna say this is a spirit then. But that means there's a cursed item somewhere, which I have not found. Which is a little suspicious. Oh, maybe there? What's that? Three lights? Oh no, that's the workbench. 
Hello? Oh no, it's just a reflection. Can you please give me your cause of death? You son of a bitch. Oh, nice. George Matthews? Is there three? Just come over here. Yeah, it's gotta be spirit. I don't know if that's... I'm just gonna try, like, to use that as a... As a way... Oh, let's go! Nice. Not a game of five. Game of four. I really would like to get the ghost. To capture it. Did I already take all the photos? Not even close. 61 activity. You're right. I need to quickly do this. What is... Uh, spirit was Lemmy, Sammy, Yummy, Ding Dong, right? Lemmy, Sammy, Yummy, Yummy, Yummy. Yes. Uh, which is Crushed Shades, right? I think. Like, especially... I mean, it might just be wrong. But this is, like, in my opinion, like... Fucked. Like, the fact that... Sil what the hell? The fact that Silica for Wraith means Quartz. But Silica for Ifrit... Or a silica for shapeshifter means obsidian. Like, it's... <laughs> Why? That's the same word, but it means something else for the different ghosts? Why? How am I supposed to know? Alright, so we're using the right evidence, or right uh, stuff now. We should just fill in that it's a spirit, and then hopefully it's gonna work? Did you see the cause of death? No, no, actually. I was oh, God! You can see it. I should have paid attention. It is poison. Poison. You can see it on the ground. Poison. All right. Get into my rune. Take a picture of the ghost and then trigger the entity by speaking to it. I guess I could try that. First, I want to take a picture. Come over here. Hello. You sure it's not poison? Oh, let's go. Voices. That's so it, it probably is. It's either a banshee or it's a spirit, which I'm gonna say based on the fact that the orb never disappears. Wait. Okay, never mind. It is gone now. Oh no, there it is. It's extreme. It's a huge orb. That is bigger than the orb from the last game. I'm saying that's a. Call it a coward again. I will never make that mistake in my life. Not a, not anymore. I've had enough had enough of dying could you please step into this yeah it's got big balls big balls come on all right what the fuck up man Beep. most young people take pride in showing their intelligence well i think it's just i think in showing your intelligence you you show worst sides of your personality that probably should try to hide or at least work on. <laughs> oh. I just got scammed. Excuse me. It scammed me out of my rune. <laughs> what the fuck? Hey. What is Banshee hunting range? What is Banshee hunting range? Uh... And she is 60. And the spirit was 70. Come on. It's like, because I think the, I think the people that argue against like good faith arguments like that, where I'm like, like, where, where I'm like, it's confusing that Wraith says Silica, it's Quartz. And shapeshifter says silica and is obsidian. Like, there is like no way that we don't agree that that's confusing. But someone that's like an asshole, in my opinion, takes that and knows full well that it's confusing, but then still tries to be a contrarian by being like, oh god. Nice. Take a photo. Oh my god. Oh, baby. Uh oh. It's a banshee? It didn't spin. Ooh. What? Wait a minute. Maybe it is a banshee. What? Was that early? Okay, so what are we looking for then? What is a banshee? 
Would be footprints? We have not seen footprints ever. I think it is. I think it's just sometimes it. Oh, wait, fuck. I just did it. Well, let's see it. <laughs> let's see if it works. I did not see it spin. And it didn't even. Oh, yeah, we did take a picture of the ghost. Was It was probably a two star because I wasn't on top of. Oh, it was a. Wait, why did I only get 40 for this photo? I'm confused. I still need to trigger with the voice. I'm not gonna say don't be a coward. I'd rather lose out. It's like five bucks. It's 25 bucks. You can... That did not work at all. But that sometimes happens anyway, right? I'm just gonna say it's a spirit. It didn't even get captured in the first place. Say hello. Will that trigger it? Hello. I think you have to make it angry. Hello. It, it won't work. This is fucked. What am I supposed to do? I think the only way... Maybe I gotta be up in the attic or something to, like, bottleneck the ghost. I feel kind of like, in this situation where you d are, can't reliably kill the ghost anymore because you don't have enough runes, the ghost can just spawn on top of me, and I'm like, what am I supposed to do? Like, I feel that that's kind of unfair. Can you please step in this? I have a flashlight. Yes, it's on, but it's very weak. All right, I just need to step in that so I can shoot you in the face. And then we can all go home. Well, you can go to hell, but I can go home. Love the granny video. I want to play all the granny games. Please. Just incense? I don't want to. I want it to, kill, to, like, come over here. And, like, if it hunts, I guess that helps. To some degree. It should be like over here because it. Okay. Creepy. Did you ever want to go into the house? Get me? I could run a tiny bit. Oh, it is a banshee! It is a banshee! Fuck! That was the banshee ability. God damn it. Okay. Uh, well, at least we know now. The banshee can freeze you like that. Holy shit, I'm potentially just gonna lose, but we're gonna see. So it is a banshee, so the orb is just, I guess, maybe it's just bullshit? Because the orb is particularly visible. You can't miss it. I felt like that was a pretty good deduction, but nope, I guess not. Okay, so it doesn't say a weakness. It doesn't say a weakness at all in the book, but we apparently it's St. John's work, which I hope they're gonna like. This should be such an easy thing to fix and like a five minute hotfix just write the different description i really hope that's gonna be because like there's a lot of new people joining the game and it's really confusing when it doesn't like explain what you're supposed to do against the ghost because there is no way you can figure it out like you can't just randomly try different things especially when you're starting out and you don't have good crafting abilities you can't just randomly try crafting materials because you don't kill the ghost instantly like, if you could kill the ghost instantly, I guess you could try. Oh, come on. Um, but because you have to, like, shoot it four times with every material before it dies. Well, St. John is the patron saint of no description. You should have known it was St. John's word. Ah! <laughs> come on, please. Don't, don't lose me more. Let's go. We're back to we're back to where we were. Okay, I don't know what we're gonna do now. So what is my plan? What do you guys think I should do? Can we put our heads together? So I'm in a situation where I don't have any more runes. So we need to kill it during hunts, which we've already seen that the ghost can spawn on top of you during a hunt. So am I gonna like leave? Am I gonna like go upstairs in the attic, far away from the ghost room? Maybe. I already have the age. I don't have the age yet. Curl up and die. I don't think that's going to help me. I need to find the age. Where's the age? I guess I could find it after I do this. I mean, I have enough life, I think, to take a hit. So I shouldn't die instantly this time. I guess I'll go to the attic. I'll just sprint to the attic. And I'm just going to sit over. Oh, here we go. Did that smoke? What is it go? Ah! What? Excuse me. 
That's terrifying. Wait, it did creepy doll. Can I take creepy doll photo? Creepy doll photo. Go, 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 go. This is gonna work. This better be in time. Oh, God. Oh, baby. Well, well. Oh, no. What? What am I supposed to do? I got frozen and insta killed? What the hell? <laughs> what are you supposed to do? I don't understand. <laughs> Like, I love this game, but like, what are you, what, what could I have done? <laughs> like, I don't know. All right, well, anyway, obviously we knew what ghost that was. Let's go to the Finch farm this time. Let's try it. All right, let's try a different map. Holy shit, dude. I get maybe I can use my shield during the freeze, but like, it killed me instantly. Like, there was no, no reaction time. I think I, like, the runes... The runes make the ghost angrier, so it makes it do more damage. But it's also one of the only ways to reliably kill the ghost, but it makes it, like, really hard. Because you kind of want to not use the runes, technically. I guess I should use try to avoid using the runes, but, like, it's really hard. Because how are you going to line up your shots if not for the runes? Yeah, I guess we could try that. Just, like, trigger it using, like, running shooting it during the hunt because you can't really avoid that happening and if you die instantly because i had full hp there before i died if you die instantly you can't avoid at least getting like cheesed one time like you're gonna get spawn hit one time so you kind of want to avoid buffing the ghost through runes as much as <laughs> oh well that's what was that a vengeful ghost that spawned on top of me? Or was that some kind of ghost ability? What the hell just happened? Was that vengeful? But did it spawn? Did it spawn the hunt on top of me? Because I didn't even hear the sound at all. It didn't even do a hunting noise. What the fuck? What am I supposed to do? <laughs> That's all my health, man. And you can't heal in this game. Holy shit. I don't know if the ghosts are just, like, being extremely unforgiving today, but I've been having the worst luck of all time. And, like, I don't really feel like I have many chances to, like, get better to avoid this shit from happening. Okay, I'm guessing it's here. Alright, here we go. This is over here. Aren't you playing on hard difficulty? Yeah. Have you ever played Phasma Phasmophobia 24 times difficulty is easier than this? Like, there's a difference between... That's also one of those things that triggers me to no end. When, like, something is so... Ins like, when something is clearly unfair and, like, everyone understands that there's, like, okay, this was a little bullshit. Like, you don't have to... It doesn't have to change. I just want you to, to tell me that it was bullshit. That's all... That's If we both agree it was bullshit... That's all I need to hear. But like, there's always those people that are like, well, it's called the hard difficulty. So if you don't die 100% of the time, is it really hard? It's like, go fuck yourself. <laughs> Come on, man. <laughs> there's so many people that argue like that. It's It drives me nuts. Okay, I don't know if the ghost was even here. I'm gonna place this. I'm just... I don't think it's here. Unless it's, like, not making any noise. Because it's, like... Don't do it. That's how I, how I feel about the Soulsborne games. Yeah, that's the thing. I mean, it... Uh... It's hard... It's, so, like, with the... With the Soulsborne games, they have kind of, like, an OP cop-out. Because you have iframes, right? And if you roll perfectly... You can technically dodge everything. So technically, if you get perfect at Dark Souls, you would never die. Like, but in this game, you don't have iframes or something. So you have less player agency. Like, it's all about player agency. The higher the player agency... Oh, sorry. Just triggered the, the bar outside. The more player agency you have... The more forgive you, the more you can like forgive higher difficulties because you can be like, well, if I get a little better, I could do that. Like it might still be bullshit, but at least it's like, well, 
is bullshit, but I can do it if I get better. Yeah, that was it. It triggered the the car outside. It's walking over here. Hello, it's another outside ghost. Are you kidding me? I don't want to deal with you guys anymore. No more outside ghosts. Is that a cursed item? Yeah, it is. It's a cursed. <laughs> cursed glass. All right, first object. Let's go. So I don't really know if the why are all ghost shapeshifters? Because the last ghost was a banshee and it was still like changing. Oh, it was still changing into different forms all the time. Is that supposed to happen? I'm not entirely sure. Okay. Um. Give me orbs. Are you here? Displace these. It's bug. I think he fixed his head. It wasn't a different model. No, it definitely was. I mean, maybe. I don't know. I didn't pay that close attention. I just know that it was not the upside down head guy. We're clearly out here. So how about we have a little chat? Oh. That's definitely vengeful. So that must have meant that it just spawned on top of me last time. Motion sensor two triggered. Wait a minute. Let's see? Where the hell is that? Uh, this is three. It came from upstairs. So it triggered this one first, which means that the ghost room is in fact upstairs. Unless it just spawned in a different room. Like, I still don't really know, like, when- Oh! There it is! Right? Oh no, there's a- There's some fan? Wait, what? I thought I saw something. Is there a fan here? There's some kind of movement over there, you see? Am I crazy? I can see it with my naked eye as well. It's shadow from outside. Okay, I see. I'm being bamboozled. You really gotta... Smoke from this, maybe? Shadows from the tree, I see. Turn on some lights. Make it a little, make yourself as a, at home. Okay, my guy. You gotta... Uh, show up now. So I triggered three that time. Let's check. Which is the middle sensor, right? Yes, it's triggering this one. And it flicked the light. Perfect. Two. Didn't... Oh, any thingies, but that doesn't have to mean anything. I wrote over here. Oh, God. What did it do? Getting EMF, but I'm seeing nothing. Outside. It was. Nice. Okay, so no EMF either. This is a tough one. It's like all over the place. There's like, unless there's like some, cause I feel like there's no way to avoid this. Sometimes I go away from the ghost room and it still spawns on top of me, right? There's no like, it seems like the ghost just randomly decides to hunt from somewhere. And it doesn't, it doesn't have to do. It's like Phasma where they just hunt from where they are instead of where the ghost room is, which makes it unreliable. Walking outside. Taking my way outside. Picking this. Yeah, there's lots of uh, camera, lots of night vision looking. This game. There are no hiding spots in this. Game. Here you go. So we haven't gotten dots. We need to be careful because it's starting to become in range. If it's not dots, but I guess we can't really rule that out. Unless it's like, oh. 
Hello there. That increased the activity by a lot. Was that a vengeful hunt? Or was that a... I mean... Can I... Please tell me that was object. Nice. I think that was... It's hard when you have a vengeful ghost. Like, to figure out when it starts actually hunting. Uh, that's voices, right? We, we figured that out. Voices. Fucking creepy-ass smile. Creepy-ass giggle. Back here. Does it keep triggering... Unless it's coming from the backyard. Does it keep triggering the, uh, third sensor, which is right here in the middle? Oh, it touched the door? No fingerprints. I mean, I can't really rule that out, but I'm gonna say. Wraith or Yure? So, Wraith is Quartz, and Yure is what? I need to do this. Let's just do Quartz real quick. Because if I don't do this, I'm gonna be regretting it later. Yeah, my HP is... Give three. Doing the rocking chair. EMF2, EMF2, there is no EMF5. Is any of these ghosts EMF5? Okay, so it's gonna be a Yure. I'm just gonna go with Yure. It might be completely wrong, but it's my guess. Uh, so Yure will be Sacred Wood, which is uh, Palo Santo shirt. Uh, one. Arctic, thank you for the 50 months. Come on. Holy shit. At least I didn't lose anything. Oh god, I don't want this. Hi there. Bark. Bark again. No fingerprints. Again. Get killed by vengeful events before it's even high enough to hunt. Oh, it went up to 80? What the fuck? Excuse me. Um, what just happened? What just happened? It's still not hunting? And the jury hunt. 75? Wraith hunts with 85. Maybe it's a wraith. I'm gonna say it's a wraith. What the hell? Oh my god, I lost two. I have to, like, not use the, the runes. I mean, I will die to a uh, one shot anyway, right? There's really not much I can do. That would be EMA 5 and footprints. I don't think it's this ghost. I think I'm wrong. What the hell am I supposed to do? Oh god. It stopped hunting. What? 85% it started hunting, which is Wraith. And now it stopped again? I think it is Wraith. Okay, so we are correct. What do we gotta do? 100% EMF 4 or 5. Trap the entity with a rune. Alright, we're gonna try that right here. Trap it. Would you recommend this game? Absolutely. Like, I think people always misunderstand that. Maybe that's why they're going for bad faith, bad faith arguments more often than not. I mean, it's always a minority anyway. But usually when I'm critical on a game, it only means I'm enjoying it. Like... When I'm giving, like, small... The smaller my complaint, the more I enjoy the game. Because it's like, I wish this tiny thing that is making my experience less than perfect would be changed. It's like the same thing with Phasma. I complain about Phasma. It was spinning! It was spinning! It's 100% correct. So we are dealing with a Wraith. Let's go. The first time it's been spinning today. Okay, so what does that mean? It means it's EMA 5? Really? I have not gotten EMF at all. What does the spinning mean? It means it's the right type. Okay, so let I guess we do this. I mean, I would like to take a photo. I have no photos left! I'm stupid. <laughs> all right, well, whatever. Goodbye, ghost. Okay, so there I was always on the up and up. Oh, you can take a photo of the... Oh, no, but I, can't, I don't have any photos. Because um, there, like I had... I'm just going to guess that it's garden... 
Uh, and I'm gonna say explosion is the death type or death cause. So I figured out the ghost. I mean, it was also, it did a lot of damage to me early. Virus. Garden! I got it correct. Let's go. Wait. Why couldn't I take a photo? Didn't I, it said like it. I don't understand. All right, we're back to being neutral and we got another thousand bucks. So we are still on the plus when it comes to money, but the reputation is hard to find. All right, let's go to Little House. Uh, I think you should always go to Little House and Old Haunting. You know what? Let's go back to the Old Haunting because it gives so much more. I mean, if we can do the game fast, let's go to let's go to Little House. Because if we can beat it fast, we can get a lot more experience for the for the guild. Did I set like the right guild? I hope I did. I set the wrong guild. Okay, well, I'm just gonna have to alt the four real quick then. Because <laughs> the thing is, you can leave in this game. I wish it would. So that's another thing I forgot. So there's four things I would like to see change in this game. Uh, the first one being hunts spawning on top of you. The second one being the weirdness of the like weaknesses of the ghosts. The third one being um, I forgot. The third one is uh, that it like resets every time you reload the lobby. It resets your guild to the f to the first one, which is really annoying. Um, and then the shared health and multiplayer. So those are my four main things that I would like to see change in this game. The shared health, the shared health and multiplayer is interesting, but I don't think it's the way to go, in my opinion. So yeah, you need to keep setting this every time you you load out of a mission, or you kind of forget it, which it's easy to forget. And you are about to die just alt the four. I'm not gonna do that. I mean, I am gonna alt the four if I if I have to like if I selected the wrong guild because the game didn't save my preference. Like I feel like that's more the game's fault than mine. So that's where I'm gonna cheese by alt the fouring, but obviously you shouldn't alt the four when you're in a bad spot, because that's just cheating, in my opinion at least. That's just being a cheesy. This is ultimately light switch? What? What was that? Did you see that? It did like there was like a electrical effect on that. What was that? Is that an ability? Is that right, you? That was something I've never seen before. What the fuck? Oh, it's a living room. Nice. Right? Is that dining room? So it's in this, right? It's right here, which if you look at the map, that is dining room. So I'm gonna have to say that is dining room. Hopefully that's correct. Uh, uh, dining room. Okay, what do we gotta do? Shoot it with a firearm, easy peasy. Uh, infrared sensor and trap it with a rune. Those are all easy, but the, the easier the objectives, the less money you get for it. Harder objectives gives you more. It's definitely uh, nice to have an inside ghost for once. We've been dealing with a lot of outside bullshit. This. I'd like to play some dots. It's locked. Yeah, yeah, you can't. There's no community right community day right now. Okay. I wonder if that's some Raichu shenanigans. What is Raichu again? Raichu is orb, EMF, dots, and fingerprint. Interesting. Shit. Oh, oh god! <laughs> I did the fucking... This is Christmas. I have two. I also threw that object. Alright, well, it's a loss. Okay, okay, dude. Jesus Christmas. You are angry. I give you my... Ah, nice. Okay, so it could be... It could be a... A Raichu, who knows? I mean, the activity seems to be spiking, but that's also because it's doing a lot. I don't know if that was just because I was right on top of it, but I have never seen that spike. So what is Raichu again? Is Raichu the same as Yokai? Because it says in the book it's a Yokai. Yokai is bone powder. And Ban and Raichu says it's a kind of yokai. So I'm guessing it's bone powder. 
I'm gonna do bone powder and engraved. Is that is that is like it's a little convoluted. I would still just see I like don't see the reason why you wouldn't just tell the player. Like I don't really see the benefit of it. Because it's not like the game is very like it has a very intricate like research system of you figuring out like it's not like remnant records where you have to use vouchers to unlock the abilities and then you can like learn slowly uh what the, each ghost can do it's not like that uh, oh god it's breaking a lot of lights i think it might be what the fuck is wrong with you <laughs> you are very angry it exploded that one. Oh, it only explodes one of the lights. Instead of both. That's cool. More writing. Already got this. Can you write your name or your age on the wall, please? Uh, so... Shoot it, and I need to capture it. I'm just gonna go for write you lost and then capture it once, which I might regret this, because obviously if it's not this, I'm gonna be in big trouble. I feel like I should really try and stop using this as much as possible. Let's take a photo. Oh, what the hell? It flicked so many light switches. Can I just shoot it? I would love to take a photo. It's stuck in here. Uh, it's spinning! Okay, so I'm I'm right. Let's go. <laughs> nice. Okay, so it is a right you. Good shit. Um, and we got the photo. And we did all the objectives. We're killing it. I'm going sicko mode. So am I going to use more runes now? I guess I should, right? Because we have five shots. I feel like five shots will kill it. And there's a Raichu hunt. I'm going to place it everywhere. Cause of death. I mean, it's only 10 bucks, right? Is it in here? Oh, it's here. Perfect. Nice. Instantly. I need to look behind me so it doesn't trigger in one of them. Accident? Accident? Uh... Okay. I am ready to kill you. I have so many. <laughs> Get fucked. It's just Christmas. I should take a picture. Yeah, sorry. I was a little distracted. Um... Come on. Come on. You have to die. You step on this, I'm shooting. I have five shots. Last. Oh, I can take this. I can take this. And then maybe we can find the age somewhere. And then we can take that too. And we have 100%. I think the age. Oh, blood? I can just take the blood. Nice. Okay, so we got all the photos. But now, is there an age? There's also an age. Let's go. All right. With that, we have a 100% mission? We did. This is accident dining room. We have all the things. Let's go. We're gaming. <laughs> nice. Holy shit. Woo. That was a good one. That was hard too, right? Holy shit. Was that 100%? Is it going to be my only perfect contract of the day? Let's go. <laughs> I did it was six minutes and ten, and ten seconds. That was a speed run. Let's go. That was a fast ass run. So that is a thousand, which we're gonna need a whole lot more before we can unlock the next uh, the next map. Holy shit! Uh, I want to do one more. I want to. Let's do. Let's see if we can keep this up. But if we die here, uh, this is it. <laughs> and we killed the Raichu. Wait, what? I did, we killed the Raichu as well. It's finally, I completely forgot that it was a Raichu. So yeah, if you, that's the thing. I did not know, but I guess that one I could see. Like there, I can somewhat agree with the, with the bad faith YouTube commenter that's like, well, it says it's a yokai, so you should have known you need to use the same thing as a yokai. I, that's like a reasonable assumption, but it's just that it was the first ghost where it didn't like i realized that sometimes it doesn't tell you what what you have to use to defeat them so i was like well this must be a very unique ghost right because it said like the weakness is electricity or something right deprived of resources it will not be able to increase its abilities identify it quickly so like 
That's what I assumed, like, you had to turn off the breaker or something, but... Oh! Well, hello there. Are you another Raichu? Love the... Look at the shadow. They hold the guns in, like, pretty... Like, the, the character models are amazing in this game. Like, far beyond... Uh, oh, nice. Outside. And orbs. Good shit. Far beyond what we're used to in ghost hunting games. Here, and I guess I'll place it here too, because usually it still walks between between the inside and the outside. Hey, all right, you're so offended by light bulbs. I don't know. I seem to not like them. Okay, so we got orbs. Which, can you take a photo of an orb? Probably not, right? Maybe? <laughs> Shoot it for no good reason besides fuck you. <laughs> Did I get a three star there? Nice. 49 was this game. <laughs> Why is this a $49 photo and not a $50 photo, huh? What do you mean? Um, the baby. Okay. Uh, what? We need to do. Completed with 80% and we need 100% activity again? God damn it. I need to craft. I need to craft salt and engraved prayer. Axe. Forty nine ninety nine. Nice. I got one more. Uh, is that was that residual or dots? I don't know because I have my night vision. <laughs> I think that was residual. Was it dots? I think it was residual. Wait, can you take a photo of that, by the way? Oh, nice. Give me five. Let's go. It could be another right. We can win twice against the right. Are you kidding me? I think residual. Not sure. Yeah. Maybe. Which would be fingerprints, right? Yeah, fingerprints. Would you go inside? Touch a door. Uh, it definitely is dots. I don't know if it's a residual now. Yeah, there. You are so ugly. <laughs> I'm sorry. You're so ugly. I was dots because it was green. Uh, I feel like it's a right here. Which means we should turn off the breaker? Because it's just deprived of its resources. It will not be able to increase its abilities, right? So... Let's turn off the breaker. We'll see if that works. Maybe it doesn't do anything. I think it might still be a residual, though. I would love to take a photo of when you do dots. It seems like dots is pretty easy to get then. Because there it did it super early. Like, it did it twice, potentially. Killing a child spirit. Hey, fuck this ghost. The Raichu has been killing me nonstop. The reign of the Raichus is finally over. Now that I've gotten slightly better. I think... I mean, if you only die by bullshit... Like, slowly the game is gonna become... Like, I, this game is already much more new player friendly than, like, metaphysical or something, but it's it's not messing around. But I feel like... I feel like without the bullshit, like, this game would still be super fun and hard. Like, I think... I think getting rid of the bullshit, like, insta-kills when it just spawns on top of you is, like, in everyone's interest. Like, I don't think... It's like, if there's one thing that, like, consistently makes me salty and, like, tilts me, it's when... You get punished for stuff you can't do anything about. Like, when you die be without, like, anything you could do about it. Um. And I feel like that's a very universal annoyance. Over here now. Where are you at? Can you go into the map? Can you touch the... I mean, I might as well just try. Oh. If it is a residual right you. Come on, spin. Spin my head right round. It has been quieter since I turned off the breaker. That is true. Only how ghosts will do. Nick Halton, think of the three months. You write your name anywhere? I already got the photo, right? But it was a $49 photo. Because apparently it was not good enough. Not good enough photo. Are you out here somewhere? 
Imagine I hit it. I can't do that. Because the ghost is, like, somewhere at all times. Oh. You get 100% activity? Damn. Did I put in bone powder? I did not put in bone powder. Oh, dude, I am crafting nonstop. Let's go. That ability has been so useful. Because before I would always lose ammo when I was crafting, and now I more often than not make more than I lose. I don't know where you are. I mean, we know the ghost room is... Uh, I didn't fill it in yet. Back here. Which is the garden. Ghost room is garden. Where's the cause of death? Is it over here? Oh, hi there. How did you walk past this? Can you explain this to me? Are you in this? With the micro microwave button sound? You can touch the microwave? Or the ghost can? Because it didn't trigger the motion sensor over there. Oh. Okay, there we go. It's in the map now. <laughs> Let's go. Is that on the wall over here? Free shot without... This is good. Not using runes. Oh. It's not spinning. I guess I could keep using motion sensors, but it's not spinning, so that means it might not be the right type. But it's like almost, right? Because we got Ema 5 dots, an orb, that's it's only a demon or a Raichu. Um, but it was still captured for a while. What is demon? Is it writing? No. Footprints? No. Cursed, cursed object. Okay, let's look around. Because we have time, right? It's not getting more active. Oh, well, okay. It's a demon. <laughs> Alright, I couldn't uh that one's on me. Not a not a two for two for one. Anyway. Easy. I could have found that earlier. Uh so that's St. John's work. I remember I'm getting better. But it still got captured. Need more photos too. Uh, come on man. I need three more photos and we need to cause a death, which is probably in here. Yes it is. And I can take a photo of that too, thank you very much. Touching everything, man. It's mysterious. Ooh. Ooh, it's mysterious. This game looks so dumb. What what do you base that on? Are you watching? You did you accidentally leave your Sesame Street on on your second window and you're looking at the wrong screen? I don't understand. Turn your monitor on. Exactly. Oh, God. What? Was it right there? I did not. I, th I thought it was right in front of me. Okay. Um, I still need the name. And I need to reach 100. I'm never going to be able to do that, right? That's completely impossible. I don't know if it is residual. I feel like it is. Let's run around, try and get 100% activity, which is going to be almost impossible against a right or against a demon. This is just going to hunt super early. But then we need to take away the engraved, like the whole, or we need to take away the engraved prayer. So we don't reduce the activity anymore. Are you kidding me? I'm fucked. I'm fucked. Dude, are you kidding me? That's some bullshit. Gonna place this here. I'm just gonna build my wall, my wall of <laughs> defenses in case it gets here. Here we go. I'm not gonna say don't be a coward. This is almost impossible. Don't hunt me. Coward defense. Come on. I have three. It, it was spinning. Oh, 
Why, why did it shoot? What is going on? I, what the fuck? Why did it shoot? Wait, I'm so confused. What happens? Huh? I don't understand what happens. Yeah, my bullets are out. Come on, at least get 100% activity. I didn't hit it. Where is it? What is going on? Oh, I did it. For what it was worth. What was going on, brother? It was like fucking teleporting all. <laughs> what? It was going like a hundred meters per second, and it came straight for me, and then it moved to the side, and it went to the. What? <laughs> what? Okay, so. Doing the 100% activity is just asking for trouble. I really don't know. I guess I clicked some kind of macro because I have some like macro set up. Maybe I clicked one of these. I think I accidentally clicked one of my macros because my, my character, like I shot one time when I was not like holding my mouse. So I don't really know what happened there. But anyway, that was holy shit. So yeah, let me know if you agree with my, let me once again. So four things. The ghost spawning on top of you. There, I feel like I was just, like, taking too many risks. Like, that was just my fault. Like, I was triggering the ghost too much by making it 100% activity. Which is just an insane, uh, like, objective, by the way. But you do get 50 bucks for completing it. But I still think that's not worth it. But, yeah. Uh, that's just really hard. Especially as, against a ghost that hunts early. Um, but, like, did I instantly die? Did it insta-kill me? What, well, didn't I have 100% 100 health? Wait a minute. What the hell? I guess I t trapped it in a lot of runes. I wonder, do you guys think they should make the runes make the ghost more aggressive? I feel like... I, I Maybe. I don't know. I feel like if it's the right type, should it really make it more aggressive? Like, if it's the wrong type, absolutely. But if it's the right type, shouldn't it make it weaker? Um, yeah, the rune buffs it. I feel like if you get the right rune, it's like something that traps it, right? I feel like that should make it weaker. But yeah, um, the ghost spawning on top of you is really bullshit. The shared health and multiplayer, I don't think I'm really a fan of it. The um, the vagueness of the weaknesses, I think they should you should get rid of that. Obviously, like uh, having like an actual someone who like someone who doesn't just put the French into Google Translate but like writes it up in like more less ambiguous English. I would really appreciate that as someone who like follows this game on foot. It's sometimes really confusing what's in the patch notes. I'm like, wait, does this mean that? Does it mean that? I don't know what this means because it's just like, it does, it's extremely ambiguous. Uh, and then the other thing uh, is like when it saves, like if I go continue here, it's going to go back to Vanguard of Gavaudin instead of keeping it on the Nightkeeper. I wish it would save that. So those are my main complaints besides that absolutely in love with this game but that's the thing when you like something you got to criticize it constructively so it can get better especially as someone like i don't real i don't understand why people are always so, so contrarian against when i make tips because it's like don't do you want your content creators to just be like licking the ass of every developer when stuff should obviously be better you just want them to be like no good everything is good nothing is wrong here like i feel like it's you have an obligation as someone who has like a voice to to say when stuff could be better in my opinion at least but anyway um let me know what you think i hope you enjoyed if you're not subscribed, please do so. If you like the video, like it. If you dislike it, dislike it. And if you want to join the lovely gamers here in chat, you can join us over at twitch.tv slash insim or click the link in the description down below. Thank you so much for watching. And if you want to watch more of me on the YouTube, you can click this video in the middle of the screen right here. Or you can check out the This Is A Ghost playlist. I've been playing this game a ton. Absolutely love it. I've been getting better over time. We're still getting wrecked sometimes. But this, I've also been taking more risks because I feel a little bit more confident. As long as the ghost doesn't spawn on top of me, I feel like I have like a... 70% win rate, something like that, because we did win more than we lost today, but we did get wrecked a few times. And at least we won our first Raichu, right? Wait a minute, because uh, I find it difficult to identify a Raichu. We died five times, but I have now finally won. That was the speedrun round where I finally won my first Raichu. So yeah, uh, thank you so much. I'll see you around. Bye, guys. Have a good one. Bye-bye. <laughs>